Hello, everybody, and welcome to Celebrity Secret Hitler at Gen Con 2018. Woo! My name is Max Hemkin. I'm Tommy Moranges. We're two of the co-creators of Secret Hitler. Um, we're joined by Mac and Mike, who I think are lurking in the background here, our fellow co-creators. There they are. And uh, we're super excited to uh, bring the game to you here at Gen Con and to the uh, jackals in the Twitch chat. Um, it's basically the, uh, the format of Secret Hiller. Uh, we're going to walk you through the rules very quickly. Uh, but what we're going to be doing today is we've invited all of our cool friends here at Gen Con to play along with us. Um, we are going to hopefully have time for two games today. The first game is going to be what we call a blind game. So we all know our secret roles, but you in the audience will join us in guessing who the fascists are and who Hitler is. And if we have a second game, I think we may play it open so you can try and tell who's lying and who's telling the truth along with us. Um, do, you wanna, do you and Mike want to do a, uh, the, the rules run through and then we'll introduce our panel? Yeah, go ahead and uh, take your seat. Okay. Max, right in the center. Uh, so as you see, we have uh, 10 panelists. We'll introduce them in a second. And uh, all of them are going to be claiming for the next hour, probably. Uh, they're going to be insisting very loudly that they are liberals. Ten liberals. Everyone give them a smile. Four of them are lying. Four of them are dirty liars. Three of those liars are everyday, run-of-the-mill fascists. It's very important to say in 2018, those are the bad guys. <laughs> yes, thank you for the easiest applause line in history. The fascists and you know what? are Nazis the bad guys. Nazis are bad. <laughs> yeah. Travis, Travis. Uh, one of those four fascists, one of those four liars is a very special fascist named Hitler. The fascists will know each other except for Hitler. So even though the fascists have a minority, their job is going to be to coordinate and keep the liberals confused. We'll elect a series of two-person governments using these president and chancellor markers. Max, you want to hold those up for the people at home? The, no, the placards. Oh, the placards. No, the president and chancellor, the wooden placards. No, the placards. <laughs> we got there. <laughs> Creator, co-creator of the game. We all Thanks, know what everybody. A, we all know what a placard is. We're all cool. <laughs> you get it. <laughs> it's one of these. Now, uh, we're going to pass laws from a deck. Matt, that was the second thing that you touched. That would be yeah, that. this one. <laughs> and that deck has... I'm shuffling. 11 fascist and 6 liberal policies. So... Even if the liberals manage to get control of a government, but they might not have the draw that they need. They might not have the resources they need at the top of the deck. This is obviously just about history. I'm trying to get all those out now. Uh, Maya will be keeping score in the wings. Give him a wave, Maya. So you can call along. Our community manager, Maya, if you've ever emailed us asking for help and you got someone helpful, it was Maya. It was me. <laughs> and if you ever got someone who was like, Ugh, Maya's not here and we can't help you, it was us. <laughs> but also if you tried to email us some other way and you were like, Maya was so mean to me, it was still me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the rules, I think, uh, anything, did I miss anything? We'll... The fascists need, uh, yes, the fascists need six policies to win, the liberals need five. But after the third fascist policy, after that hat gets covered up over there, from then on, if Hitler gets elected as the chancellor for the rest of the game, the fascists win immediately. Boo. Yeah, and that's bad. <laughs> yeah, whoever started that boo, come see me after the panel, we'll give you a copy of the game. It's a good boo. Uh, but if the liberals can get a hold of one of the bullets on the, uh, on the fascist board and manage to kill Hitler, the liberals win immediately. Yeah. yeah. All right. I can't give 150 free games for that woo. But killing Hitler is good. All right. Uh, everyone already knows their role. We're going to get started with the presidency. It's uh, sitting right in front of Max. But first, Max, you want to introduce our panels before you uh, 
kick things I, off? I would love to. Uh, so I'll go around starting over here. Our first panelist today is Trin. On my card here, it just says Friendshipping and Awesome. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, the, uh, definitely recommend checking out the Friendshipping podcast and uh, family of products. It's really delightful. And uh, not accusing anyone at Gen Con of anything, but if you struggle with social skills and uh, dealing with people and making friends, this podcast is a, a really, really good and positive uh, uh, community and resource for you. Uh, so round of applause for our first guest. Trin. Our next guest is Arnie Niekamp. Arnie is the host of the podcast Hello from the Magic Tavern and a designer of the Jackbox Party Pack games. The new Jackbox Party Pack 5 is coming out. This fall. This fall. Sometime. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them what they've won. Uh, our next host is, uh, wait, yeah, Adel Refai uh, from Hello from the Magic Tavern and my personal favorite, World News Tonight. Uh, yes. Next, yeah. We should applaud for everyone now that we've established that precedent, I feel like. Uh, our next uh, guest today is Travis McElroy uh, from the Adventure Zone podcast and the McElroy family of content and uh, podcasts. Um, and definitely check out the Adventure Zone comic, the New York Times best-selling Adventure Zone comic. Two weeks in a row. Um, on my right is Matt Young from the Improvised Shakespeare Company and the podcast Hello from the Magic Tavern. <laughs> Mr. Stuart Wellington from the Flophouse podcast. <laughs> that's, that's the podcaster's podcast. <laughs> uh, next up is Matt Chapman, co-creator of Homestar Runner. <laughs> His brother, Mike Chapman, also co-creator of Homestar Runner. And if you have not, if, by, round of, by round of applause, have people here backed the Trogdor game Kickstarter project? Thank you. Please go back this game. It looks really beautiful. It looks really funny. There's a great Kickstarter project. Go check it out. Back this game. I'm a backer, uh, eagerly awaiting it. One of my most anticipated games of uh, uh, this year, so thanks for Thank thanks you. for making that, guys. Yeah. And <laughs> our final panelist tonight is Anita Sarkeesian, co-creator of Feminist Frequency and host of Feminist Frequency Radio, also one of my favorite podcasts. Thanks. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> All right, um, Trin, will you pick a number between one and ten? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Stuart, you will be our first president. Right. <laughs> I'm so glad I was never gonna be the president. <laughs> so um, if some of us have played this game infrequently, should we just roll with it? Yeah. All right, yeah, let's right. do that. Let's do that. Now Stuart, as president, what I think will Max you is hope that. to achieve? Uh, well, I'm hoping to get my very liberal agenda. It's <laughs> a good answer. Nice. <laughs> uh, Healthcare for all. Yeah, and you know, Yay, <laughs> yeah, federal jobs guarantee. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, why don't you guys just uh, the smart people should say what I should do, and I'll just do it. <laughs> That's what I wanted a politician. Yeah, yeah. Um, let's see. So, what, what do I do first? Here? Uh, so, you're, the first should move is you're going to pick or? you're going to pick anyone at the table and appoint them as your chancellor, and then together you're going to work together to pass a law. We don't really have any information to go on, so <laughs> if I'm the first well, president... We should probably start with like a quick quick raise of hands. Who's liberal? <laughs> yeah, so I think we won. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Game over. Yeah, I mean, I'm, nice. I'm spoiled for choice. That's a, that's a pro strat. <laughs> <laughs> we nice. never... <laughs> to see one person be like, oh, oh no. Uh, <laughs> it's all over. Yeah. I, I think the fascists are in the audience. <laughs> oh. No, oh, no, no, it's just a joke. He doesn't actually no, think that. No, right. I, think, Arnie. I think Gen Con Indianapolis audiences are the most liberal audiences in the world. Oh. <laughs> Took me a while to get through, but it's fine. Okay. Um, so I would. Ju my strategy from the first president is I just pick someone like far oh, away from me. Yeah. So if things go sour, they're not like immediately next up to become president. Well, because president, 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 president will go rotates. clockwise around the okay. table. Or yeah. somebody near the end. I think the safe but. choice is to pick the person who seemed most eager and used their thumbs the most, oh, and I'm going to give a touch for him. <laughs> <laughs> I feel really good about your decision. Okay, so now we vote, right? Now, now we, we vote. vote. We use our placards and we vote. <laughs> our two placards. <laughs> <Our two> <laughs> Me and then we grab from the placard pile. <laughs> 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 all right, does everyone know how they're voting? So we're voting yes. all. Wait, what? 
You're voting. So on we're the so we're now we're voting on the, oh, voting on the president, right. ticket of Stuart right. and Trin to pass a law on our behalf. Okay. And we don't really we don't have really any information have any yet. Yeah. So okay. One, two, three. So that passes well, we unanimously, oh, yeah. I believe. Because we don't know anything. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that was so judgy. Oh. Yeah, my goodness. And as for last year, if anybody wants to, when you flip a jaw, you feel free to sing a jaw rule song. <laughs> jaw rule, baby. Yeah, if you just want to say, also, you know, yeah. what would I do without you? Or, yeah. from, no, I mean, also feel free to not do that. He's so prolific. Okay, bye, He's so prolific. bye, guys. Bye, Matt. <laughs> just drop the card. Okay. Getting pretty nervous. All right, so huh? um, I will give uh, three policy tiles to Stuart. Stuart, you're going to secretly look at those. You're going to take, you're going to get, discard one and put it face down on the discard pile so that no one can see it. And we'll pass the other ones over to Trin. There's a lot of high stakes passing in this table arrangement. Oh, <laughs> uh, don't. Oh. <laughs> oh. That was close. Up. Yeah. And, and is it official that there's like a no, no mugging while you're yes. looking at cards yes. That's rule? why I, I just picked mine like immediately because we don't want to tip off what's in our hands. Although yeah. you can lie about anything. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. This is my play and this is my discard. Okay. And I probably should have. Discard and we'll do the play. And it's a liberal policy. <laughs> okay. So now we start to get our first bit of information. Stuart, what did you pass to Trent? Uh, I, I, passed a, uh, I passed a liberal and a fascist policy. And what did you pick up? Are you making that up just now? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that sounded uh, false. And I, I think, uh, <laughs> what day is it? <laughs> Where am I? Why do I smell too? So, so, so Stuart, did you pick up, you picked up three. What yeah. was the, what what was the third one? Uh, I think it was a fascist policy. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Tran, did you receive a fascist and a liberal? I did indeed. Okay. Okay. All right, so now the presidency passes and I'll be remembered oh, fondly. Chancellor. I mean, just to say, it's a little suspicious. Where are you going to set up your library? <laughs> oh, we can, we're passing this way. A little suspicious Stuart couldn't remember right. his cards. Yeah. You don't know Stuart that well. It's not suspicious <laughs> at all. It's totally fine. I think as soon as Stuart looked at yeah. him, he forgot what they were. <laughs> to be fair, this is peak Stuart performance yeah. right now. <laughs> at noon, he texted me 420, so I think... <laughs> Uh, I'm looking at a, a, a double mat uh, ticket here, so I think. Uh, and I'm right, and then, I'm right in thinking that you can't pick someone to be chancellor who is just in. Correct. Yeah, you, there's, there's, a, there's a term limit mechanic. Yeah. So the last two people who were elected to a government can't be um, immediately picked as chancellor, but then you become unterm limited the next time there's a government. So I want to pick Matt because he's the furthest away from being president. I just want to find out some information about what's going and on. And not because he table. has your name. I mean, it just it's it looks good on a poster. Yeah, the T-shirts, <laughs> yeah, yeah, bumper players. stickers. Yeah, yeah. Council yeah. of Matt. Matt, Matt right? times Matt <laughs> equals freedom. <laughs> And Matt recognized Matt. It's and true. if something happens to Matt, it's just a smoother transition. Yeah. <laughs> you can yeah. keep the same bumper sticker. Yeah. Exactly. Everyone just, they don't use last names, they'll just be President Matt, so then in case. Yeah. Yeah. It's hey, it's it's me, President Matt. So I don't mean to, uh, you know, discourage friendly banter, but I must say, I find it interesting, Matt, that you skipped over Anita, who would have been the next logical step if we're going across the table. So mm. I am actually going to vote nine. <gasps> if, if we're going across the table? That was what um, uh, Stuart did first. Is He was like, I'm going to pick Trin. She's further away. She's across the table. And then, you, well, you seem so confused. I'm switching my vote. No, I... <laughs> no, so because, solid no, because, politicking going on here. you watch Stuart's performance? I feel, I don't know that there was a whole lot of, like... I think that may have been totally arbitrary. Wow, total, the, the Matt administration has total disregard for the norms of our government. Yeah. <laughs> Switching back to I'm nine. Gonna, I'm, gonna exp, I'm gonna explain my logic one more time because I think president is moving clockwise, right? So it, it would go from you to Anita and then it wouldn't get to these guys till the latest. So I, I'm just trying to figure out information about the people who this is the furthest away from. That is my... And That's a, I like that the I like your web of lies end, right? that you're spinning. <laughs> I don't like I'm it. I'm really not. What? Uh, I don't like it. The Chapman inquiry. Like yeah. Okay. You know, right. sometimes you got to go with your gut to yeah. find yeah, Hitler. Yeah, yeah, I, I think what Trin is saying is sometimes you just have to go like to 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 be progressive. You have to look outside people that just have the same name as you. Okay. This is just where we sat down. Let's <laughs> vote. Hey, wait. How many votes, Yaz, do we need to pass it? Uh, it needs a, a simple majority. Oh, okay. So a tie so is a no. Cool. Yeah. Okay, I'm okay. in. Yeah, that would be six. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Give him numbers. <laughs> One, two, three. Yes. 
Yeah. But now we can't yeah, see Yeah, what do we got? So <laughs> wait, wait. Okay, so we, we got two, nine, nine, three, nine. nine. So it passes. Okay, yeah. wait, who else so voted who's nine? got the nines? Uh, Travis, Max, and me. No, I got oh. a nine. Oh, you, Adele. Adel. 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 You know. That guy. All right. <laughs> so that guy you, with the, the beard. The Matt oh, administration has been elected. All right, so great. I will pass you three cards. I want to say I voted nine because Matt got bumbly and dropped something earlier, which seems sus suspect to me. <laughs> my, my voting card I dropped? Yeah. And also voting because placard. seven, eight, nine. Okay. <laughs> Trin and Adel are throwing a lot of shade at me for no fucking reason at all. Oh. No, this is just who I am. Can so we this curse? This is the play. passing? Yes. Okay. And it's a liberal policy. It's a liberal I'm oh. surprised. Yeah. Ooh. So Matt, what did you pick up? I got two fascists and a liberal, and I discarded a fascist. And you get a fascist. I got liberal. one of each. So yeah. wait, so now how many fascist cards are in there total? So I think it's is it nine fascist and eleven yeah. liberal? Okay. Does that so, mean no fascists in this game? Though? Oh, sorry, eleven fascists. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> I get it. How many fascists? So it's eleven fascist. Yeah, Tommy's got the mic. I think it's eleven <laughs> fascist and nine liberal. It's it's in Six favor liberal. of Six fascist. Liberal. Yeah, I'm just trying to keep track. And so I don't remember. I don't okay. remember. Yeah, it's, uh, it's six liberal and 11 fascists to start. Okay. okay. And okay. if so, everyone's and telling the truth, there's four which I doubt, that have already been then there dropped. are yeah. two liberal cards that have already come out. Yeah, yeah. four fascists, because of I and four fascists they, they both just, said that they drew which means there's two fascists. There's still seven and fascists right. and four liberal in the deck, if everything is true so far. If yeah, the thing we learned true. recently is math always works out. In yeah. this game, okay. So. <laughs> so now... Uh, we have President Max. When do we start accusing people of shit? Whenever you I already am. <laughs> oh, I, I've been trying. I, 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 I am incredibly uh, curious about Adel and Trin throwing so much shade at that when literally all I did was drop a card because I'm a klutzy idiot. <laughs> <laughs> well, here's and, and, so and I'm trying, to, I'm trying to figure out what's going on at this side of the table. The thing That's is, like the, classic the game play. is to suss out yes. fascists. So yeah. why are you know to just be like yes, 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 game over, whoopsie, you know. To be fair, point, it is also the second president. That's yeah. true. Yeah. Yeah. Well, to, to we me, haven't even made it halfway around the table. And, and you're like, oh, the information's in the card drop. <laughs> now I see. You know how fascists have slippery fingers. You know how, you know how Mussolini was like vaudeville? Uh. He's always, always slipping on napkins. And but, but he I was also, a waiter in his uh, early days. I'll also say I've played this game a lot with Adel, and he will always... You, you'll always talk the most about like what's happening. So and it could just be I, that he's already theorizing. I vote no up top because yeah. I don't want to just say yes to every president because yes. then you don't learn anything. If you say no, then you start to, I feel like you start to learn. And then is it I think you have to say Matt? yes to the first I hate year. Matt. Okay. I think you have, hey. But this Matt, this Matt. <laughs> All right. I think Adam and I play similar. I'm going to send this down to Anita, who we skipped over in the last round. All right. <laughs> because oh, no because, <laughs> because <laughs> the table works. Yes, Matt. <laughs> That's my that's my nominee. Okay. Hello. Hey, bud. Do I get to vote? Yeah. Yeah, yeah everyone yeah. must vote. How did you vote on that last election? Yes, I voted yes. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Everyone got it. One, two, three. And that had, there's I see one no. Who's the no? Adel. Oh. Adel. Well. Oh. See now. On brand. <laughs> okay. I feel like you just keep voting for Gary Johnson. <laughs> Dennis Kucinich has some good ideas. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, so I look at these and then I pick one. Correct. Yes. <laughs> which one do you want? To, which one do you want to discard? This one. That's a dis no. discard. No. Yeah, that one. Sorry. Okay, sorry. Yeah. So sorry. I almost this forgot is, which this one. This the discard. <laughs> That's discard. You're gonna play. Yes. Yes. Yeah. No, I don't. There, yes. Oh, you'll time. see why. I'm, yeah. Tell me when I can open my eyes. <laughs> Fascist. Fascist. Uh, so, Max, what did you pick up? I drew three fascists, and I had to pass two. Did over. you get two fascists? Yes. Okay. So that means the so numbers we, bear that out. So, they, Max, you get to investigate yeah. someone's card. Yeah, I'm gonna do an investigation. Um, I miss the good old days of Matt's. <laughs> you know, I didn't appreciate so President and Vice President Matt when we had him, but now <laughs> I'm gonna investigate. Well, you, do you want my input? Sure. I, I'll take. Because I, I always have it. Yes. I always have a little input. Please do. So Travis is next. 
no matter what. He's the yeah. next president. So yeah. looking at his card makes sense. Yeah. Adel and I are both in, uh, like, people are throwing shade our way because we talk too much. Mm. So maybe us. And Nita didn't have a Here's choice. Here's the thing, though. You guys both voted no on the Matt administration, which did pass a liberal policy. Yes. So I voted no on Anita's as well. I Adel's just going to vote no. <laughs> That's how he operates. I think I'm going to investigate Trent. Okay. Yeah. Let me make sure my so card's in the right So you get to order. see... You get to choose I will somebody, see, yeah, so and then you have that information. And then and I have that it. information, okay. and I will share it with the. Do I you will mind? share it accurately with the table. And face card is yeah, my face card will be your like party role. Oh, okay, I'll just well, slide that. Not, I was not your identifying. Card. I actually think you give me the other one. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Before you look at the card, do you mind looking dead in the camera and saying this is a true investigation? <laughs> <laughs> This is a, a Channel 7 true investigation. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good punch up. Trin. I say no, but I have fun. <laughs> Got it. Trin is a liberal. Oh. Yeah, but you don't have he, to tell We don't know if we right. trust him or not. Yeah, we, he doesn't have to. Well, okay, but I mean, here's a logical coming thing, from right? a fascist if president. He was a fascist. <laughs> if he was a fascist... He would, she would, he would know unless one of them is Hitler. Wait, okay, unless Max is Hitler, he would know that she was a fascist. Right. So he wouldn't choose to investigate her because then he wouldn't pick up any information. Unless he was trying to, unless he's trying to take throw, a, yeah. throw us off the scent. That I don't know. Hitler. I feel like they. Count, count well, I'm people, happy with if it. If I was a fascist, I would have picked you and lied about your role and because thrown you under the bus. Person. Yeah. Yeah, I would have like destroyed the next administration. There's a lot going on here. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I feel like at the very least, it's always good to know, like, now for this game, to some extent, Max and Trin are linked. Yeah. So they would, That would be true no matter who we yeah, picked. But that's one directional. Yeah. That is also true. That is one direction. And he I might be a fascist band. who saw my card as a liberal, and he's like, okay, now I'm in cahoots with somebody I know is a liberal. Um, so I'm going to say, I'm going to pass my chancellorship to Trin, since we now have one vote that she is... Uh, liberal. So if I pass her a liberal and a fascist, she'll either have to pass the liberal one yeah. yep. or we'll know. And 100%. in addition, I also remind you, Trin got a choice in the first round and played a liberal card. So yeah. I think, that's a, I think that's an excellent bet. I'm looking real good right now, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I have a question. Who, so let's say that you get Who's unlucky. Hitler? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, Hitler say what? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, if okay, so let's say you get unlucky and you get three fascist cards and you have to do an investigation. Who do you, who would you investigate? That's a good question. See, I'd want to say Adel only because he has demonstrated, no offense, any kind of abnormal behavior. <laughs> um, also I because might. I love Adel, but you don't want him to win if he's in the middle of all the people. <laughs> I'm, not gonna, I, I'm hanging out with him <coughs> for the rest of the day, and I won't stop hearing about yeah. it. Um, I might go with Mike, only because I have very little have no information info about him so far. I like this that a lot. I, I think there's, yeah. I, I think it's easy to like throw shade at people who are talking a lot. I think Trent's probably actually okay, but also like, if you're Hitler, you might be playing a super quiet. Like, yeah, I, I have not like been quiet. Quiet. I didn't play super quiet. You might be. We have an investigation by Max. Yeah. We have what she has passed. So right. we have the most information about Trent. Right. I'm least worried about her. Sure. Whereas basically the four over there, I, well, except for Stuart could have passed Trent the two fascists instead. He I has no idea fascists. which cards he picked up. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> okay. Remember the glory days of the Stuart <laughs> <No>. administration? <laughs> I passed a liberal card. He gave me a, yeah. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. But he, he could have trashed he, a liberal. He could have sent you two fascists, but like, I picked up three fascists. Old goldfish so I would say these Stewart. three are the ones I have the least amount of information about. I'm Don't overlook right. what makes but the best poor man, too, though. He's like, the one that hasn't done Yeah, so that's why I would, that's why I would say anything. <laughs> yeah. I was no, I'm just saying. Well, well, wait, wait, wait. Sound and it makes right. trust Arnie has a joke. Oh, do it. Everybody, Arnie has a joke. Lean forward, lean forward. I was just saying. It's like a fireside chat with to the edge of your chair. I was just saying, don't overlook who, what names might make the best portmanteaus is you got like this. You got nothing this. is going to top a true investigation, uh -huh. but like, uh, you got this, 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 Arnie, Arnie, all right, so I've got a setup now. All I need is a punchline. <laughs> do you want us to circle? Do you want us to circle back? <laughs> okay, uh, comedy writing 101. Oh, god, improv is not my thing, really. Uh, <laughs> 
Uh, I think, I, you know what, I'm sadly thinking an Arnie investigation sounds pretty good, <laughs> but I don't really want that because I know I'm liberal. Okay. And it would be a waste of my time. So, can we cut that from the live stream? <laughs> <laughs> can we get okay. Got another, can we get some one. suggestions about, from the Twitch chat? Yeah, exactly. Tranquisition. <laughs> In, and you gotta so investigate we, we her again. Investigate <laughs> Wait, can I be the Trinquisitor? <laughs> yeah! Okay, wow. let us vote. All right. Oh. I've forgotten what I'm voting on. <laughs> so this is the yeah, oh, this yeah, is the yeah. this is the uh, Trin Travis the Travis Trin administration. Oh, we'll do a portmanteau of that. T R. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ready? I don't know how I feel Matt, about this. We've got a one no. Just one. Again. Just one no. Again. <laughs> Wait, okay, he so actually only has two no cards. <laughs> Yeah, so is this broken? Is he the one on the corner with the like political sign that's just by yes. himself with a yeah. megaphone? Yep. No matter what's happening. Your face. They're inside our me. skin. Smells are disease. Okay. That's the play, and this is the discard. Oh, fascist. Well, card. I got two fascist yeah, I got three fascist cards. Okay, let me say something. That means that there's ten. That's yeah. ten fascist cards. Yeah, yeah, so that we're means full up. That means if everyone's selling the deck. Full. Full. I have important so piece of information. One yes. of these four guys. Can we please note that at this point in the game, it's way easier for fascists to play fascist cards because we've already passed two liberal cards. Right. Mm -hmm. Travis picked me specifically. I was just cleared as a liberal. Okay, uh, like also, everybody said clear. yeah to this, which means most of the fascists passed this. I think that Travis is a fascist. Well, so also, <laughs> didn't Max say that it was three fascists, so there were six fascist cards in a row? Is that's, that what we're led to believe? Yeah, but yeah. I will say statistically, that's not that far off, because if you have 11 and six, like, you're going six to Six in a row, up, though, and these well, two both had two fascists, Here's the too. good news, though. Statistically, statistically, I can be proven out as we keep drawing Statistically, yes, there have been. Yeah. I got three fascists. We you're you're also believing the draws of the previous two people. Like no, they, I know. They could have each one buried a liberal card, right? And right. then we wouldn't have accurate information. Yeah, so. yeah. Can I throw out a theory? Yes. Well, we, we, do, we have sure, an investigation. Yeah. No? So. Then that's a no? Well, <laughs> <laughs> I will also counter, I will counter Trent's point by saying if she is a liberal, right, and I was a fascist, I wouldn't have picked her to be my chancellor because then... No, I you absolutely would, because then you could throw me under the bus early in the game. Yeah. But I was supporting you just before this. <laughs> I, I don't I'm, know. I'm I don't on know board with what Trin's saying yeah. here. What's I think that? that makes a lot of sense. Say it again, say it again. And I actually think... I actually think Max might be a fascist too. But I know uh, the but uh, so right now the only two fascist things that are on the table were played by Trin, though, right? I mean, Incorrect. I no. played a no. liberal card. Which and was, oh, you, so you've done Trin, one of each. Trin played a liberal card and a, and a fascist card, and I looked at her. Piece. I've seen her roll card, and it's a liberal. I'm going I'm, to, I'm going to uh, investigate. I'm going to Trin quiz it, Mike, and, and okay. find out. And that'll give so us one give more him, piece of information. So I give him. I give you uh, my. The party, party affiliation, affiliation card, not yeah, the, the party the membership one. card. Okay, be yeah, very careful that you're not showing the other side of the table. Yeah, let's all try not to look. Yep. Let's be cool, everybody. <laughs> be chill about this. Do I give it to you? Yeah. <laughs> Drop like a tip. <laughs> okay. <laughs> there you go. So he's a liberal. Um, so if we assume that these are two of the liberals, right? Because at this point, we have information that people have seen cards and said liberal, right? I would say that Trin is safe. It's I have liberal. a very good voting record. Because at record. this point, her track record, isolate her two fascists because I threw three fascists, so I wouldn't count that against her. So at this point, if we get a third fascist one, she is a safe pick for Chancellor. Cool. That's what I would say. Into it. It's a, it's a mixed legislative bag. Yeah. 100%. Yeah, it's like we did. We did ACA. A lot of Democrats voted for the war in Iraq. <laughs> still probably good enough to be president. Really. Do you want to explain the next power that's unlocked? Oh yes. Yeah. So th that great note. So the next power is a special election. So after a fascist power is played, um, the uh, president will immediately get to declare their successor. So we'll have one turn out of the normal rotation, and then it goes back to the rotation. Back to, okay. Yeah. okay. Okay. And that's if a third fascist policy gets... That's yes. if a right. third fascist policy gets played. Mm -hmm. President Adel. Uh, can I get the... Wait a minute. Oh, wait. You, go, you got three. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. we asked you that. Yeah, okay. you did. Um, so, the top 12 cards can be more fascist. <laughs> <This> seems suspect. <laughs> so... Let's talk about it. Talk wherever, it out. Wherever I pass this to, I'm going to vote no. So, what... <laughs> <laughs> so, so, what does the table want... What does the table want me to do? Well, I, I think... 
that you could pick Stewart potentially if you're worried that like he wasn't telling the truth at the beginning. That's okay. fair. So one of these four, you got to figure out. No, okay. We it's know one of these four. The we know one of these four is fascist. If, this if this you are a liberal, yeah. you should pick him no, because okay. he is a liberal. Okay. Oh. And I trust him to tell us what to get. I don't okay. trust you, but you're going to vote no. No, that's fair. Yeah, and you should. Yeah. Um, I mean, I, my my only thing, I agree with that. I think that makes sense if we want a safe choice right now. But uh -huh. we're probably going to pull more fascist cards right now yes anyway no so we might want to yeah it's not we didn't less, reshuffle we're oh, less right. clear oh, okay. about does that happen does the re yeah, yeah. yeah reshuffle well, happen at some it point? does oh, yeah okay. this should be so a right pretty now close we, if we're we trying should to be collect able to have good information idea there. Yeah. and figure stuff out mm -hmm. then we need to Somebody have hasn't. the last person who touches them the chancellor be a liberal I, so that they can say i know at least two of them were blank I, and so if he picks someone sorry i will no offense that is a fascist. Offense. We can't trust the information that the fascists give us. I have looked at his card, and he is a liberal. But I also don't trust you, Travis. I'm sorry. No, he you trust him. Uh, I would. I'll take your word for it. Here's, here's the thing. <laughs> Even if you don't trust me, this is a time to test the theory. A hundred percent. Either I'm lying, and he's a fascist. Right. Or I'm not lying, and he's a liberal. At which point, like, we'll get more information. Can we call this trust? Don't trust, or trust? Don't trust? Can we call this good cop, strong bad cop? I love it! <laughs> Yay! Okay. Um, Adel, I just, I agree with you. This side of the table has been fairly untested. Okay. I, yeah. I'll also just say, like, I always get nervous when people start, like, all of a sudden championing someone out of nowhere, like, trying to get the table to buy trust in them. No offense. But we are overlooking uh, Matt, who did pass a liberal policy. This, this is, is fair. Yeah. yeah. Like, no one at the table is saying, like, let's put Matt on, and that sometimes that's a sign that they're just, like, a good liberal and they don't have like the fascist horde trying to let them in power. I, I played a game of this last night and Wait, the, it, are you saying that you are suspecting that? No, I'm saying no, it's a good I'm saying it's a good the yeah. fact that nobody is like being like, oh, we gotta you know, it's 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 troubling that everyone's like, oh, we gotta get Mike in there all of a sudden. Matt could be a good no choice for overlooking. Maybe yeah. he's just Growing up, bro. everybody always suspected Mike, though, so I mean, it's, oh, yeah. it's, just, it's oh, just always a, been in the background. Matt's always out there being, <laughs> being the fascist. <laughs> no, no. Whoa. 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 See, bum, new information. So, the one last thing I'll say is at this point, we have one more fascist policy, right, before we are worried about who becomes chancellor. The Hitler condition right. will right. be live. And so we need to figure out before then at least two safe picks for chancellor, right? Because we, we can't pick the same person twice if they were in the presidency, the administration beforehand. And if we don't have at least two safe choices, the chances of accidentally picking Hitler go way up. Right. Yes. Right. I, so right. at this point, I, that's why I'm saying test the theory when I say, or test what I'm saying if you don't trust me. Hold that on. He is liberal. Since, since I didn't get a refresher on the game before we started, <laughs> no. um, the middle thing is that the if the that fascist law gets passed, then the president of that turn gets to choose the next president. Correct. Yes. Yeah. And then. If Hitler becomes president in that process, becomes chancellor, chancellor, no, it's, it's after then, it's after the third fascist policy is down. Then we're in, enter like the Hitler zone, and if oh. Hitler becomes <laughs> chancellor, the fascist Who's the Hitler zone? immediately <laughs> win the, the game. Hitler ultimate. Okay. This yeah. year, on Travis Spotify. spin off podcast. <laughs> <laughs> so who, who are you thinking for chancellor? So, <laughs> so you are president. You can't yeah. hand that one off. Oh, well, we'll see. Uh, <laughs> honestly, I do what I want. You can't say no to yourself as <laughs> president. <laughs> I'll not make myself. Um, I mean, well. So we think Mike, we know we, uh, we know Mike and Trin are liberal, to, to, uh, to be believed. Mm -hmm. if, you, and if you trust. We're <laughs> saying we have the most information yeah. that we may be liberal. Yeah, cool. I would that? pick between the two chaps if you were going to. Mm -hmm. I'm into that, Between too. the two what? Chaps? The two chaps. brothers chaps? Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. Short version Has Anita been name. a part of anything yet? Yeah. Yeah. I was the chancellor. Yeah. Oh, uh, never mind. Anita was chancellor to mm -hmm. Max. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Um, I think I'll go with Matt. This Matt. I was just... It's getting a little testy over here. <laughs> Stay out of my room. <laughs> oh. I'm betting Adam's going to pick no. Just a guess. You're about to be surprised. Okay. Ruby Count it down. Oh. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> Travis, would you? What do we, what do we got? <laughs> yes. One no. 
Two knows. Two knows. Two knows. Oh, two. Oh, Adel Max knows. Max knows. Adel knows. No. Why, why no to this? Because Adel voted no. He said he was voting no on his own president. You can show us his Madel now, though, yeah. which is yeah. great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. great Once again, I will say that it is likely that fascists voted yes for this. Wait, wait, wait. Arnie why? has a joke. <laughs> because there's, there's It's almost four. there. He's got it. Because there's, He's looking at this because there's four <laughs> fascists, and we had two no's. So that means that, oh. yeah. So if two of the fascists are super down with this combo. What's your joke, buddy? Oh, boy. I've been sitting on one that I'm like, don't tell, say this one. But I'm, I, we oh, are no. really in a period where it's, we've got we, a Travis theory that seems very good. And so we're teetering on either he's right and he's got it mo mostly figured it out. Is the or he's a fascist. Be travesty? It is. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. It was taking forever. <laughs> As soon as he said my name, I was like, Travis. I love, yes. the, idea, I love the idea of a stand-up who does like a 10-minute set, set, and as he's setting up this line, some of the audience just goes, like, Travis, <laughs> right. I want to do something about yeah. shoes. <laughs> it's like the Beastie Boys method of stand-up, where you yeah. get the audience ready yeah. to just say the punchline yeah. all together at the same time. Powerful. Oh okay, so now you get the three. Oh, policies. yes. Uh, from this round? <clears throat> yes. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> Is there going to be a nine tile for you? So let's just not look. This <laughs> <laughs> policy just did somehow. You scratched off the thing and wrote nine on it. This will be my discard. discard. <laughs> I'm yawning, by the way. You could uh, marry no, a table a and down, abdicate. I'm <laughs> about to let I'm everyone share the crown. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So listen, for <laughs> pro possibly the first time, truthfully, no I've been handed top? two fascist cards. Oh, okay. And so I am discarding wow. one and wow, wow, I'm wow. having to play another one. Okay. And that does not okay. help my case, I understand that. So I just want to make sure I have all the facts here. So all the other times that someone drew two fascist cards, they were lying. But no, when you not got yeah, the yeah, two. one. I'm saying at least one of them. And so wait, the two cards that were left, you get, we get sh we shuffle, they shuffle them in. They shuffle them in. I would say statistically though, right, there was only the two Liberal cards played, and there were only two liberal card. There were only two cards left, so that's four liberal cards. So if all the other times the liberal cards that had the option to be played, right, that's only four liberal cards. So somebody has lied. Somebody and buried, buried a liberal yeah. card. Can I yeah. buried a liberal card? Just so real quick, and I don't mean to do this to you. I picked up three liberal, handed him two liberal. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so honestly, so what the, so uh, what the hell happened? So. Not only is he Hitler, that like sounds real legit to me. I want to know what the hell happened. <laughs> well, and he's also a wizard. <laughs> okay, so at this point, Stewart and Trin passed the liberal. Yes. Right. Wait, so I don't know. No, he passed one, but he passed the first one. So it's very possible that he was like, "I gotta go. Get I can't." I mean, I, I, I'm just going by numbers of what people said that they got. Right? I have a question because I am hard because I suck. Okay. Liberal no, you're two great. Well, no, so so Anita, there is you're like the you're like the new guy on the I first am. episode I'm of the first sitcom first where you're the audience surrogate the and yes. we get to like That's what I'm explain doing. like well, oh, as way yeah. it's like the new guy on the show. As you know, okay. deputy, this is where we keep the criminals. So so statistically, because math is clearly my strong suit, could. Could um, he have been lying and given him two fascists but had a liberal? Yes. yes. Yeah. So, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Because somebody is lying. In fact, that, that like almost certainly happened that some fascists got it cards, did. buried liberals, yeah. and then said they only got fascists. No, right. it, it is certain. Yeah. 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 Wait, it, it happened, it had, it yeah. happened at I, least twice. Let's, yeah. let's reset. So listen, Raise your hand if you're liberal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking, I've got a so, theory on trend. That I'm liberal? The first, she passed the liberal policy, but it was the first one, right? Yeah. Very safe. Very safe. Safe move. For okay. a fascist. Main trust. Fascist. Yeah. And then she was identified as a liberal by Max. Okay. Possibly another fascist. Who passed a fascist by Those are the only two liberal indications we have for Trent. I, I, I understand your viewpoint here. However, I do think, <laughs> hold up. <laughs> I do think that liberal cards were buried early because we started having three fascist policies uh, pulled like right the fuck away. Well, according okay, to Okay, right now, raise your hand if you were president and you claimed to have drawn three fascist policies. Yeah. The most trustworthy yeah. guys. Yeah. <laughs> right away. Yeah. So and, the but these two, these two also said they drew two fascist and one liberal. Yeah. But if they drew two, if they managed to bury liberal cards, that would have... 
meant that that would have swung it. It would have very changed far. the odds for us a little bit. Right. Okay. We so special... Arnie gets to pick the next president. Adel while being Adel, the Adel, Adel, Oh, that's yeah. the way. So, so you get to Sorry. choose someone at the table to become the next president, okay. and you don't need to worry about term limits or anything. You can pick Here, anyone. Here's what I will say, because I am a liberal. Yes. Right. I'm not going to campaign for myself to be chancellor if you don't trust me. We need to pick someone that we absolutely 100% trust to yes. be chancellor, because now we're in the Hitler zone, where if we pick, and so this is where your voting becomes very important at this point, because I, I do not trust. Votes battle. are always important. Votes are yes. always important. I, 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 register <laughs> now. I, because I do not. I don't trust at all. At all. I think who. I think who. I think whoever the president is. I think whoever the president is, we should make Trent the chancellor. Oh, because see, I, I think I, she's I the only one I can trust. Now you're, I you're don't convincing know. people I'm Hitler, buddy. Oh, I'm really not <laughs> meaning to. Because I think Travis is trying to get Mike elected as chancellor. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. Arnie has that, a limerick. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> I think no, we have I, to. This is very confusing. Trent from uh, being chancellor at all costs. Like. Well, then we should. Then, okay, then let's make her president. Because I, I believe she's either. a liberal. Okay, but Adam gets to pick. But if we make. We, well, I'm so, and Hitler has to be chancellor, right? And we also get to yeah, vote. So I, even though the placard gets Watching us tear each other apart, <laughs> you monster. Okay. Yeah. We still get to vote. <laughs> so if you feel iffy on whoever, let's say that I'm, okay, I'm president. Um, so if you feel iffy on who I pick as chancellor, let's talk this out. I would like input. This is a very important part of the game. Um, okay. So who, now just, who, who just a want? reminder real quick, there is a mechanic that if we fail three, uh, elections in a row, like oh, if we don't pass, yeah. then yeah. the next tile on top gets flipped and automatically passes. Right. Oh, just whatever it is. We, yeah, we actually yes. have, just, just this, I actually have nothing so far against the, the Trin presidency here, but just as a reminder, we haven't actually voted no on a single yeah. presidency which this is entire so game. Worrying. Oh, which, we haven't voted no? No. <laughs> <laughs> as a, as uh, a group. Just, as news a group. to me. Uh, okay. Which we, can, we should just keep in mind that it's okay yeah. to say no. Yes. I think in a big game, it's harder to do that. So, um, <laughs> the only female president? God. Um, so, here's, here's the deal. Is America ready, though? This is what <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. Well, they're going to get ready. So, um, I am, I, I, I'm not going to choose the first three people. And, Matt, like, you're okay. vibing me liberal, but I do feel like a liberal policy was buried somewhere in here, which Fair makes enough. me lean away from you. Fair enough. Um, I was thinking, so, Travis, I still don't fully trust you. Fair. Um, uh, I feel like, so we, we've kind of, we've gone iffy on Mike, right? Or yeah. Matt? I, okay. Mike. Mike, we're iffy on Mike. Because Travis we're and Mike are Mike. connected now. We shouldn't, okay. be, we shouldn't be iffy on uh, Matt because I had three fascists, so he had no choice. Okay. And so but, and this, this Matt, I still <laughs> but I don't want to go testing uh, this at this point. Right. So you don't have well, to can, I can't be chancellor right anyway. now. Okay. Let me yeah. explain yeah. to you logically why you should make him your chancellor. Because at this Which point, pointing you at two make, people. Uh, who are you pointing uh, Mike, at? Mike, Mike. Okay. Because at this point, he is the only person who has not been a part of an administration, right? So, so this is a great time to test new blood. No, hear me out. Hear me out. Someone in this side of the table as president buried liberals. Yes. So you can't trust any of us as chancellor. 100%. Right? So your choice now is from these four. And right now, Arnie hasn't been part of an administration, and he has not been part of an administration. So you can't trust Anita because she has been part of an administration. But so what your choice you, is between these two. What did Anita do? She was part of an administration that voted before now. And the only information we have is that liberal policies were buried. So you can't vote for, you can't make chancellor anyone who's been part of that because we're all tainted at this point. The only two people so, you well, can Travis, trust. Travis is arguing that people, you need to get someone who hasn't done anything so we get more information about more people. I 1,000% disagree with right. well, you. are the president. So you get to decide. <laughs> that's, that's why we need, I'm not saying that's that's why that. we need that's a, saying a businessman to get in there. We'll just run the government like a business. <laughs> New ideas, folks. This We're going to get so, the best people. So that's Travis's argument. But the other argument is to test someone that you suspect. Well, right now, I, I don't we want to no, sorry, not suspect, but someone that you think but, is liberal. But right? this is why I'm saying uh, the only piece of information I have that you can take a leave is that I for sure have looked at his card and is for sure a liberal. And I don't trust you, which makes me not want to trust him. You should. Okay. Oh, he, the, you may not trust. You should trust what he says. Go with your gut. Could be. The swamp. <laughs> <laughs> So okay, let me let me talk out what I'm thinking. Yeah. Am, I winning, am I winning the audience? <laughs> the only so, it's the opposite. What's the opposite of winning the audience? Y'all, this is what I'm thinking. I actually think I want to go with Anita, and here's why. 
because if I pass her a liberal and a fascist and she passes a fascist card, I get a bullet, I'll just shoot her, she'll be out of the running and it'll go right Jesus. to my face. But if, <laughs> if you're worried that she's a fascist. It's not dark. If you're worried that she's a fascist, I think she's I mean, so she is already dark. I only worry that she's a fascist as much as I worry about any on this anybody on this side of the table at this yeah. point. So wait, you're gonna then make it army. Because Arnie at this point has him part of an administration that is buried in it. There's no chance of burying anything. So what I'm saying I is disagree. that- I disagree. Trin, I, tr I think you're 100% right. I, I trust you completely. I feel, I feel Arnie, really good about this. do you have a campaign slogan? I, and I think that, like, and I have a fail safe of I will shoot her in the head. <laughs> <laughs> you keep saying that with such gusto. 2018, yeah. Okay, can I, get, can I get one clarification? Yes. At the beginning of the game, when we all had our heads down, yeah. Thank you. the fascists I'm, saw what? I'm looking forward to not The fascists Hitler. see each other, and they see who Hitler is. But Hitler does see, not know who the fascists the fa are. Hitler doesn't know the fascists, but correct. the fa fascists know themselves and Hitler. Right. That is correct. I remember when Obama said he'd shoot Biden? <laughs> <laughs> and, if, and if he causes problems, just uh, take him, take take him the fuck head. out. Uh, okay. Counterpoint, remember when President Rosalind put a silent off the airlock? <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. Oh, Fair enough. God. That All right. show. Uh, so who, we're voting for Anita. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, Trin, Trin is president, Anita is chancellor. Wait, hold on. Do you want me to go through it again while I'm doing this? I assure you, my logic is sound. <laughs> All right, ein, zwei, drei. So, who voted no? It passes. It passes. Uh, and there are four I, fascists wait, in this game. Anita, okay. so, there, so just real quick, who voted no on that? Can I you just raise no. your hand so we can get the count? So one, two, three, four, okay. So it passes. So they don't trust me. Anita, are is you Hitler? Is that what this information means? Are you Hitler? No. If you're Hitler, we, the fascists have won the game. Whoever the fascist players are. If you're Hitler, the fascists have are won. You Hitler? Yes. yes. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> Yeah, I, I was like, is this a trick question? I voted nine, too. I voted nine. My I only voted nine. nine. My only I voted nine. now as well. We oh. like to Hitler. We like, we like to Hitler. I didn't know that that's how the game was. was into my life. I got, I got, no, I, just I, say, I fucked that up 100%. I, I, think it was, I think it was great that Matt trusted that administration 100%. Matt, why didn't you listen to my logic? Who I you thought, buried? Travis, I thought your logic was really smart, actually. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, you did great. Yeah, you did yes. great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, that's why I posted, because I mean, you were fascist. <laughs> we <laughs> should have totally trusted Wait, you, so but I both Wait, so who were the fascists, exactly? Having the three. Four of them. So you did. Yeah. And did, uh, wait, did you say him? I did. Yeah, I tried right. to bury Damn myself because you're playing the game. Yeah, yeah, right. That's what I. Yeah. So you could that well was, play. I just want to say that that was terrifying. Thank you. Yeah, you could 100% really... be very successful as a serial killer if you really. <laughs> <laughs> no, I swear. Okay, okay. Uh, or, or, to be a politician. I didn't buy it. So, I didn't buy it. So here's the thing. First of all, how do you know I'm not already a serial killer? Second of all, Fair. I'm very smart. <laughs> I'm very smart and I'm a fucking monster at this game. Sorry to tell you all that. Yeah. Yeah. It's only. I went right. into this game with one criteria that Adel could not win, and I am really <laughs> upset. <laughs> So wait, who you, is the other fascist? You threw you off so you? well. Because oh, okay. every time you had, you were about to say something smart uh -huh. that would have helped correct the course of the game, yeah. Adel would just go, oh, Matt's got a riddle <laughs> for us. <laughs> <laughs> it's no. true. I had so many really brilliant things just on deck. My strategy in life is to undermine Arnie. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> I, right, I will it. say, when we were off stage setting this up, Max was like, don't worry. I'll keep things moving so the game is under an hour. Oh. And then they spent 20 minutes debating oh God, that election, and I was like, <laughs> we are oh, under no. an hour. We, we are, yeah. 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 But you, well, that's what I'm saying, is yeah. we to won your on, credit. Like, the fifth round. Damn. Uh, we, that was an hour. You wrapped it up real quick. I yeah. will say oh, that I great. claim a moral victory. <laughs> yeah. And a logical victory. Yeah. And those don't count. I didn't so. know, but they counted my part. <laughs> I had no, I had, I had no real strong feelings either way until that, oh, until the end. And then yeah. I. Yeah, because I started yes for you clear. twice, and then, and then I was certain. It was sorry. the fact I that it was the first welcome. Sound. <laughs> so He's all in. That was all right. So let's. Uh, are we playing with? Are we switching out players? Same players. Will you? Are we to All right. Tommy's going to take my place. Selinker's here. We're also going to swap uh, out mics uh, for our good friend Mike Selinker. Oh, Mike yeah, so, yeah. yeah. I'm yeah. out, guys. Bye. Bye. Thank Thank you, Bye. Mike Chapman. Thank you. How's it going, everybody? I hope I'm getting through this. I hope I'm a little bit. Oh, my God. Oh, Mike, thank you for playing. Earlier, Mike was like, oh, if there's one more 
If we have too many, oh, please, for the love of God, let me sit out. But he was, I should have turned the mic off when I dropped it down yeah, my shirt. Yeah, that was great. We're going to throw him back in the middle. Oh, uh, we'll get you. We'll get you handled. Uh, one quick Beth? note, something I forgot to promote at the top of the panel. That's because we're the uh, seriously, please actually register knew, to vote. It's very I important in this trend. election. And if you're here at Gen I Con, we, you can come to the Cards Against Humanity booth. It is booth number 3,000. We're here with the uh, Indiana the Democratic Party. We're registering people to vote regardless of party identification or anything. Just come and register. We'll give you all the information you need to register and uh, show up and vote. And uh, we really do need uh, smart people who play board games and, uh, and all of that to like, show up and save our country. So please do that. I usually run into that. I like That's that totally right. and, like, and like people, like in werewolf people, are like he's the werewolf, and I'm like, what? So, uh, yeah, no, so I'm trying to win. I'm like, I will immediately <laughs> get killed. Like, oh, I yeah, just, yeah. I want to win. <laughs> <laughs> All right, while we're while we're resetting, yes. Okay, everybody. Yeah, so we're gonna have everyone shuffle seats on stage. Okay. And um, while we're resetting for our next game, uh, does any, uh, Mike and I uh, can take some Q and A about Secret Hitler or the process of making the game or anything people have questions about. If there are any audience questions. Yes. Not yeah, everyone at yeah. once, though. Because we can't take that volume of questions. Do you want We've got a full, you've got a full pineapple yeah, here. Yeah, you even have a pin. Okay, sure. Hell yeah. Got it just for the outfit. Can't believe that. Yeah, are you just as very proud of you? Because you went in last time. It was less squishy. Questions from the audience? Hi. Oh. I like being closer to you. Want to be oh, front question front over here. Corner. You had to kind of be on the corner. Can yeah. we switch classes? Yes. Just snaking my way across the stage here. The question is, do we have any expansions planned for Secret Hitler? Not yet. We thought about doing a communist expansion, but three teams is very hard to balance, and we don't know how this version got balanced, so it's kind of a... We're just too... Like, I, I, we've explored it, but nothing yet, I guess. Except for the Trump pack, which is no longer available, so good luck. Yeah, I think we, I think we all, we're, we're all excited to like keep working on Secret Hitler, and we all like the hidden identity mechanics. But like Mike said, this game, like, this game was just, ba it just sort of ba like miraculously balanced itself. And in fact, now we have a big data set of games, and it's almost exactly 50-50 fascists and liberals for almost every number of players. So we really don't want to screw that up because it's like a, it's kind of like a perfectly balanced on a on a knife's edge game. Um, Probably do one more question while everyone is is yeah. chatting over there. Yes, over here. Get some reference. <laughs> yes. The question is, can we explain again how the fascists won? So after three fascist policies are played on the board, you you like uh, unlock a, a, a danger zone. You unlock Hitler mode, where if Hitler is elected ch in the position of chancellor the fascists immediately win the game. And Anita was Hitler and Trin got her elected in the position of chancellor. So Hitler can get elected as president and it doesn't do anything, but if, they, if, if the Hitler player gets elected as chancellor, the fascists win. And also interesting, I think that's the most likely, that's the most probable way that the fascists win. I actually, I don't remember. Tommy, do you yeah, remember? What's up? Uh, who, is that the most? Or the yeah, so most? what's interesting is, for certain values of interesting, uh, <laughs> Yeah, fascists ele win by electing Hitler four times as often as they pass six policies, and liberals win by passing policies four times as often, so the same ratios, as oh. they win by killing Hitler. So liberals win by passing legislation, not by, I don't know, swinging for the fences. Yeah, being thing. a liberal is boring and tiring. <laughs> but and right. It's right. <laughs> <laughs> There are no political analogs to that work hard instead of swinging for the fences thing. <laughs> no. so we'll, we'll take one more question, then we'll, we'll kick off our next game. Yep. Do you have any statistics on, does the win ratio vary based on experience? Um, general, I think, if I'm remembering correctly, I think that the liber um, if it's everyone's first game, the liberals are really likely to win because what people are, are a little scared of lying. Like the first time you yeah. play, you're like, how much can I push this? But really quickly, by like the second game, people realize like how easy it is to like look into your loved one's eyes and just li straight up lie to them. <laughs> <laughs> is that a, I mean, just yeah, yeah. yeah. So <laughs> you gotta leave it all on the table. Yeah. yeah. The what's really interesting is even though games 
globally or 50-50, within certain groups, fascists and liberals tend to start with huge advantages based on the group dynamics. <laughs> Sometimes really experienced players, when they're playing with newer players, screw it up because they have like all of these rules that they've built up and shortcuts. Yeah. And it's like, oh, these are nine other people than your friends, and they don't work the same. Hitler getting killed only happens in early games. Once people have played a couple times, you stop. Hitler stops playing, uh, obviously, and starts playing super secretly. And so Hitler will die, but only in the first few games you play, probably. Yeah. Well, I'm super excited to play your perfectly balanced game. Thank you, Mike. I feel I feel like uh, there's no need for any improvement. Should uh, we? Well, the way you us, say that makes me think you do. <laughs> uh, joining us for this next game is uh, game designer Mike Salinker. Uh, Mike is co-creator of the Pathfinder ACG of uh, the what is your new game that has been released at oh, Gen Con this year? Thermwatch. Yeah. Is it available at Gen Con right it now? It is available at Gen Con right now. And Thank you. Uh, and do you do you have anything else you want to announce? Like maybe a book project or oh, anything yeah, like yeah, that? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so uh, if you like uh, games and political analogs, and I'm assuming you do, uh, I have a new book out uh, called Game Theory in the Age of Chaos, which is the uh, a set of game and politics essays that is part of a humble bundle that is going on right now. Uh, it is the humble book bundle, game design and puzzle craft. It's also got my book Puzzle Craft in it and the Kobold Guide to Board Game Design and a whole lot of other great stuff. But if you'd like to see that, we would love to have you come on board. And uh, also check out the uh, relatively new uh, Widow's Walk expansion to the sure. classic game which, Betrayal at House on the Hill. Which, my friends. Which both Anita yeah. and I wrote uh, scenarios for. They're the two oh, good okay. scenarios in that game. <laughs> hey, now. All right, so this is going to be a, a public game. So we're going to, so Tommy, or do you want me to Why lead you? you? Yeah, I'll lead the night uh, phase, and the audience will see how the um, night phase I kind of want Tommy to lead it now. We well, can't, can't play. Yeah. He's part playing, of yeah. <laughs> Is, are there any instructions we should give the audience? Yeah, yeah. So, okay. So that means, um, audience, you are going to become. You're about to become part of this game. So if you cheer or moan or boo or laugh at the wrong time, it will ruin the game because you'll like signal to the players that you know what you're doing. So we're counting on you to be good participants in the game and help us keep the suspense for the players. Um, and also, in case we don't get a chance at the end, can we just have a huge round of applause for the Chicago high school students who are running this amazing stream? Oh, yeah. Doing a really good job. oh yeah. Thanks, everyone. All right. Uh, any other? Every, everyone have their roles, know their roles, and everything. Oh. All right. So it is night. Close your eyes, everybody. Close your eyes. Um, okay, fascists, regular fascists who are not Hitler. Uh, oh, all players, please extend your hand out towards the middle of the table into a fist so that everyone could see it if necessary. Uh, regular fascists who are not Hitler, so just the normal fascists, please open your eyes. There should be three fascists with their eyes open. Maybe give a little wave to the audience just for visibility purposes. And make, fascists, make sure you recognize each other. There should be three fascists, they should all make sure they make eye contact. And now, Hitler, keep your eyes closed, but extend your fist into a thumbs up. So only Hitler now should be making a thumbs up. Fascists, make sure you see Hitler, make sure you see each other. Fascists, please close your eyes. Hitler, please return your thumb to your thumb bunker. Yeah. <laughs> that's Hitler a game. Hole. That's that's a game term. Yeah. <laughs> Do we prefer Hitler hole? Is that funnier? Yeah. No. <laughs> Hitler, please return your thumb to your Hitler hole. Hitler. And um, everybody can bring back their uh, fists, and you can uh, open your eyes and just shake it loose, everyone. Let's just shake it loose. Oh, yeah. 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 I feel like it's time for democracy. <laughs> I like that you have oh, whoever and, uh, give a thumbs up because that was his trademark. Mike, yeah. Yeah. Give us a, a number between one and ten. Let's go with nine. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, oh, nine. Sure. Travis will be our first president. Okay. I didn't plan that. No. Who I didn't plan that. don't I trust? So Trin, you're out. I know. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go right across the table to Matt. 
That's why we got up and moved seats is whenever we play so that grudges don't oh, persist. Oh, they're still going to Yeah, no, if you're a, yeah. oh, clearly like you're a next I level. I like that I'm the only person here without grudges built in. Yeah. yeah. That should be great. You'll catch up. I'll catch up quick. <laughs> I, I do like how you said built in. Yeah. Like, no, 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 I, I add them. them. I, don't have them yet. I yeah. add them early. Yeah. Are you voting no on everything again? Should we all Early on, that? I'm going to vote mostly no. Okay. 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 Get some info. I'll vote no up until it becomes um, Your turn? An issue. Oh. My turn, yeah. What's it called? My turn. Yeah. Which way is it going? Is it going go clockwise? Yeah. All right, are we ready to vote? Yes. Oh, what's the yeah, I mean, name? Oh. Travis. Okay. Reveal. What? Two nose. Oh, two, two nose. nose. Stuart. Stuart. That's Stuart. not like you. What's going on? Stuart. Hey, bud. It's what's a up, new guys? game. <laughs> it's a new game, new stew. I'm trying to New stew. <laughs> <laughs> uh, stew kid on the block. Deal with it. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, wow. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Just having fun. Yeah, man. Get some open. Oh, you got it. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I passed. I got two fascists and a liberal, and so passed a fascist and a liberal. I got one of each. Awesome. Mm. Great. Oh. Ah, and your cover the most statistically complete. likely draw. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what happened. And. Mm. <laughs> I feel like I got to be president in whatever the opposite of a leap year is. Like, you got two days, like, cool, here's one thing. Okay, on. Right. You're McKinley. News. <laughs> News. Or, Garfield. No. or Garfield. I can never remember which one. Harrison only Harrison? had 30 Harrison? days, right? Harrison had, like, he had nine, right? Oh, no, he was the ninth. 28. Yeah. All right, so... Do you guys want to hear us talk about which yeah. president? Uh, uh, of well, course, Taft got stuck in a bathroom. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what? Name one other presidential fact. Uh, yeah, I didn't think Andrew so. Johnson. <laughs> Andrew Johnson's the only president uh, to be impeached uh, successfully. Successfully. Now mug it to the camera I'm in his league. Well, that's a, that's a <laughs> I also have a hard time remembering which one's Andrew Johnson and which one's Andrew Jackson, and I feel like that's a trick history has played on me. Uh, <laughs> one of them is a racist. Yeah, Maybe Andrew Jackson. You don't know that the other one was. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe the other one. Okay. So, new Stu, what you thinking? Yeah, where's your where's your? Oh, hey, you know, I'm You're pretty best. chill right now. Uh, Versus See, that manic game, Stewart before. Last game, you know, lying people have a tendency to talk a lot, but I couldn't tell what was performance nope. and what was a lie. Uh, so I just, I don't know who to believe or trust anymore. Although... It would be feel, different people now, though. Yeah, I, well, don't try and make a case right now. It's as if I put a lot slate, of hope into you last time. It's as if the slate doesn't get wiped clean with Ever. I I'm I think I'm I think I'm gonna pass it to Matt. Uh, I don't know because he took that different. chair and I didn't have to sit right on the edge. So you're hey, we're together. Awesome. The, the Stu and Matt ticket. Mm. I like it. Reveal. Is it all Yaz? Oh no, well, two Tommy, nine. why did you say no? Okay, I was just saying how moving chairs wipes away grudges, but I'm still mad at Matt for last year at Gen Con. So, <laughs> wow. <laughs> so maybe that didn't work. We're multi-turning I, I, this thing. I should fill in that last year at Gen Con, I convinced Tommy when he was president to make me as chancellor when I was Hitler yeah. and he was liberal. <laughs> wow. It was good. That's not I, how I... I, I, got him, I got him real good. I don't think I remember that. That's, That's heartbreaking. But this is a new game... And let's Everybody try not to look. It's a new year, a new you, a new stew. That's right. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. This card. I got two fascist cards. Uh, uh, yo, that is trash. Yes! What? Uh, Revenge will be mine! <laughs> Do, what, what did are you, you talking pass? about? Wait, is that your new catchphrase? <laughs> oh, dude, that is trash. Did you pass a liberal and a fascist? Yes, of course I pass a liberal and a fascist. So what do you mean, of one. course? It's not okay. inevitable. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I, I assume everyone has the same experience I do. Uh, <laughs> Just you universally? Yeah. Like a shared consciousness? No, so I picked up, I mean, not, not to beat that old horse, but I picked up uh, two fascists and a liberal, and I quickly discarded a fascist and passed one of each to Matt, thinking he was my dude, and he totally <laughs> betrayed me. I got uh, two fascist okay. cards. Well, I mean... I don't... I, I also, honestly don't I'm, know... I mean... I will say Matt I'm did... I'm also a terrible liar. Yeah. 
Men, here's, here's the thing. Statistically, okay, so definitely one of them's lying. So this is absolutely. I am uh, two into logic true. puzzles, and I apologize. I was about to say. No, no, bring it. Safe space. Yeah, but yeah. so right now, the two of them, all we know is one of them is lying, and until we know which one, neither one can be trusted. But right. I will say, it makes less sense for for Stewart to lie, because if they were both fascist, he wouldn't have said he was lying. Right. And if he was a liberal then Stewart wouldn't have said he was yeah, lying he to up. call him out. Like, mm -hmm. it makes no sense for a fascist to call out a liberal as fascist unless super early on, Stewart is trying to establish that we can't trust Matt. But that's a bold fascist move to make second <laughs> turn of the game. Yeah. So, I but, know I'm a bold guy. You know? I also just got some but intel that last voted year no. Matt uh, pulled off a pretty uh, amazing performance I heard on Tommy too, yeah. here. But Stu so. voted no on that first thing for no reason whatsoever. I for mean, for so. Stu to be the liar here, though, Stu would have had to have decided, I'm going to pass Matt two <laughs> fascist policies, and then I'm going to do a thing where I have to be involved in every argument for the rest of the game. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah. This would be there. Stu he deciding. Stu also did like leap to his feet. Yeah. He was like, that's trash. No, never mind. Yeah. Like, I don't know which Stu, is... what is it? Is there a problem? I mean, I guess. He's lying. I don't know which what is it, them. boy? Is Tim is stuck trouble? in the well? <laughs> I don't know which of them is lying. What I do know is this is a new Stu. This is a new And so it could be a new fascist. And also, don't let, like, I will don't also know. say, what don't let his laid back experience. He is a game master who plays games all the yeah. fucking time. So, so I, I wasn't well, I don't know what to think now. But, I'm just saying, all we know right now, the only piece of information. Let me ask you a question that might clarify. What were you last game? You were a liberal, I was a liberal, yeah. So you're a new you now. Wait, before it all passes, I get to... Yeah, you get to investigate someone's right, loyalty. Because I'm a good dude, and I get to check it out. Sorry. Yeah. But who do I check out? Matt I, also did the traditional... <sighs> I, it was a little overly dramatic. I, that, was my, that was my gut thought. I only, what, but then I thought like I was an awful person, because I was like, what if he's really feels bad right now, though? That's, only that's, that's how he emotes. Yeah, yeah exactly. Only person I would or or he sees those, the future of the Matt, game ending with, with, with death and Because we already have a fragment of information about him. And you guys the next president, no matter what. I'm going to investigate. My okay, favorite so part of this game so far I is that your Matt said Stewart's lying, Stewart said Matt's role. lying, and right. Travis the goes, yellow card. I'm a bit of a logic puzzle yeah, now. <laughs> yeah. One of them's lying. I really like these. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, no he, right said, right to me. he said statistically <laughs> one of them is lying. <laughs> I, well, <laughs> that wasn't my point. Two people accused each other of lying. To get a pipe. The numbers show. To be fair, Travis, I have to bow to you as a logic puzzle expert. Why? I mean, you know, you certainly don't, you certainly have shown that uh, there's no puzzle master. Look, look at me gladly <laughs> handing the <laughs> reins of power to my affiliate over here. So so what, what does that mean? Well, what is Anita? Wait, what? Oh, well, she's, <laughs> is it, no, she's a liberal. But we, again, like we me. don't all have the same right. information. Right. So you, you, well, she's on my team. I thought your information was I'm Stuart, a liberal. Thoughts on words? Thoughts on words. Thoughts yeah. on words. Okay, so you've investigated her. She's you have liberal. told us she's a liberal. That's what we know? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And she gets to be president. Uh -huh. Hello. Hi. Hi, to a new age. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Um, remind me, you two did the first one, right? Yes, yes. we did. Yeah. I think um, these two. I kind of want to go with Trin just because, like, ladies. Oh, yeah. I know, but, but I don't want to because then it looks like yeah, because yeah. people aren't going to get I'm just saying. I want it everyone sure to know that yeah. I would like to choose ladies, but I'm not going okay. like to. I didn't get it. a lot of choice here, just saying, whoever organized this panel. <laughs> oh, you find more women at Gen Con. <laughs> I will next yeah. year. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Yeah. That was, you shouldn't have said that. Yeah, I know. I have. <laughs> as soon as I said that, I was like, good thing no one's watching. <laughs> Sorry. Um, okay, so we don't. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't, uh, don't worry, don't worry, Tommy. You're not connected to an electronic device yeah. in any way that's yeah. near you. I'm, the, place I'm maybe the only person that can see he's pouring it directly onto his microphone. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I'm not. My badges. You can that's a, that's an upper way. level game theory I'm to sorry. prevent further yeah. flaws. Right. Right. There's no that chance that you can be, be Hitler if you're electrocuted. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um. So, but so, I think. These three, right? Are so I should choose because we don't have info about them yet. Yeah. Wait, right? In in theory, yeah. Which Do, three? You're off you're the saying me oh, yeah, I don't mind. Mike? I feel like I'm gonna say your name wrong, even though I know your name. At all. But just because she messed it I up. I fucked up. It's, yeah, Abdul. Uh, <laughs> think Paula. Think so, Rush. Rush. Yeah. It's Adam. Adam, right? I did know that. Yeah. I have your number and everything. Mm -hmm. uh, why don't I make you my chancellor? Okay. 
Cool. I that's not based I'm on. Vote no. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna vote no for uh, yourself. It's that coming is, up that awfully. That is actually based on nothing because I don't feel like I have enough information and I want to get someone new in. Uh, I would it's have preferred Selinker, but I mean I'm okay with this. He's a handsome man. <laughs> And it's that was just such a good joke. <laughs> oh, me? Yeah, I'm great. Oh, you're talking about yourself. I thought you were saying, like, oh, yeah, Selinger, he's a handsome man. No, no, Selinger's a handsome man. I'll let you, you know said what? that. I'll let you know when I'm complimenting me. It's every other sentence. <laughs> <laughs> All right, were you voting? Yes. Three, two, one. Uh-oh. Wow. Well, that doesn't look good for us. What happened? Uh, that's... That well, went five down. Nine, so yeah. Five yeah. nines? How did that happen? How many of us are there? Okay, so either. if you're holding yeah. up a nine I think it's right your now, fault let's start with Matt. Why did, you why did you say no? Because Stuart just said that Anita was liberal, and I don't trust Stuart. Oh, fair enough. But, yeah, right, you can't. Okay, I mean, okay. Fair enough. Uh, I didn't like that two in a row, that just two over. I'd like okay. to see more. Yeah, the same way. Like, Adel's going to be oh, president what? Is that fairly a... soon. It doesn't necessarily make me suspicious of Anita. I just don't want to give that much power to Adel because he doesn't have to. Adel, why did you vote no? Because Adel. <laughs> but you was there one more? And Stuart. Uh, I voted New yes. Stu. I voted yes. Sorry. Thanks, buddy. But I so kind of I wasn't I wasn't sure about Adel, so I just kind of randomly shuffled my votes and picked one. <laughs> nice. But, Good gameplay, my man. But now I know that Matt voted no. And who else voted no? Uh, well, okay. Uh, so I'm assuming you guys are also fascists. Well, there can't be five of them. Well, I'm not. Oh, you also voted no, right? Yeah. Okay, so there's it. four fascists and me. Got it. The rando. <laughs> so I think I think that checks out actually. So for the rest cool. of this game, I know. you shuffle our cards and choose. Yeah. <laughs> so this does bump up yeah. to one fail. What does that mean? Um, we didn't pass a. Yeah, each we, time you don't pass a. Eventually, a card will flip over automatically. I don't love your logic. I'm sorry. I will say the only two pieces of information that I have right now is Travis that more. out of the two of them, one of them's lying. Right. Yeah. And <laughs> Stu said Anita was liberal and Matt voted against her. How do we Fair feel about So it's not that we know that Stu is telling the truth. I, I, so just, I'm guilty by association. I, I no, no, no. I'm saying, sure. well, but Stu, you're fine. Uh, new stew, same old recipe. Uh, <laughs> um, no, I love so much stew. You're one of them. Okay, he doesn't care. Um, if Matt is fascist and Stewart's telling the truth, then Matt voted against Anita, who Stewart said was liberal. If Stewart is lying yes. and Matt is telling the truth, then Stewart. So, which island are we on? I feel at like this point, I, <laughs> okay. I would say it's 60-40 that Matt was the one that was lying. Okay. How do this we feel forward. about me putting Anita on since we didn't find out anything? So that we don't like later have just this Wait, gap in knowledge. That's my chancellor. As your chancellor. Okay, I so we, was don't the, love it. I, I'm trying to, like part of what I'm asking is, is was the problem the just the gap, like the distance between them, or was it Anita the specifically? Space between Thank you, Adel. Uh. <laughs> so I was I was on the fence for the same reason because it was coming up pretty soon, um, but I didn't. Okay, but that's like you played. Like I wouldn't have known to make that. Yeah, I mean, 100%. I know you said it, but I didn't know that that's a thing you do for why the whole. Which is why I event, Which is why I, I voted yes. It's because power. I didn't think that you were. Yeah, I don't think you do. Well, so five no votes, and there's only three fascists or four fascists, including yeah. Hitler, at any point, right? So if Stu did just randomly pick one, then. And, and we assume that the other four people just if we're saying, okay, well, let's assume those four people are the fascists. Well, why don't we ask them why they voted no? I, mean, voted I will say <laughs> that I have, like, one of my few hard and fast rules in this game is I, the... the, the you don't want Adel to win. Is I don't want Adel to win. <laughs> my second rule is that I, I, especially early in the game, I am a big believer in moving the chancellorship as far a, around the table as possible so that someone doesn't get power twice yeah. very regularly so that logic puts it in anita yeah so i don't it isn't my vote isn't even necessarily reflect anything about anita i'm, I'm just thinking like i'd rather not get anyone anita so for what yeah, I'm listen, that so what i'm rapidly. hearing, I'm hearing twice. of this is literally everybody who voted no except for matt did not have a reason uh to oppose the group in Specific. So are you saying right? that none of the fascists said I voted against it because I was fascist? <laughs> well, I'm but kind of saying 
one or the other, right? Okay. Either I'm, because I'm liberal or because I'm fascist. Because you voted no because you chose randomly. You voted yeah. no because you vote against yourself or anything all the time. You voted no I'm because you didn't person. want a concentration right. of power. Voted, yes. You voted no because you didn't want a concentration of power. Only Matt had an opinion about whether or no? not. Yeah, I voted no. Yeah, concentration only Matt of power. Had what an I'm, actual opinion about the ticket in question. What I'm hearing is we voted no for like a weird conglomeration of reasons, and it feels like, feels like a dead some turn. people are are now like. I mean, oh wow, like wow, that's, no that was a referendum, and it's like. No, I don't yeah. think it was. I think yeah, you I told agree. us not. It's just yeah. like, all right, all right, data. Yeah, then I'm gonna put. <laughs> Like, whip, off, whip off your Anita, sunglasses yeah. and let's hit that uh, who intro. I'm going to make Anita my yeah, chance. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I don't like it. Okay. I look forward to you expressing your opinion through the miracle of voting. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Ready? As you should, Present. too. Get registered. Present. Okay. Matt's a nine. Stu's a nine. That's four to six, so it does pass. So four Matt and Stu agreed on this. They can agree. I don't, but they, they never have yet. Well, but they no, well, actually, they, they Also, there's been a lot too. of discussion about Chancellor. We shouldn't lose fact, uh, uh, focus on the fact that we're also voting on president. Very true. So if yeah. Stewart could trust right. Anita, oh. so liberal oh. policy. Oh. All right. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> so what, what did you draw? What happened? I drew two fascists and a liberal. That is concurrent with what I received. So you received concurrent? a fascist. Is that the right word? Yeah. You, okay. you received a fascist and a liberal. Yeah. Okay. Well, right. So maybe Stuart was telling the truth about Anita. What no, else no. was he telling the truth about? <laughs> it's as if that's oh, just, it's wait, just, wait, it's just, that's you just coming out of the air. Me. <laughs> well, well, hold true, on, but I, he I also trust... voted against my presidency. That was, that was random. I <laughs> don't believe you. Well, then, so you, so you why did you right. also vote against her chancellorship? Yeah. You so voted you against her. I think I thought, because you voted against her, I thought you were a fascist. Okay, how are we feeling now? I mean, I'm less sure about that. I can admit when I'm wrong. Come on. There is always that. Not, not that I don't trust you, Tommy, because I think that the fact that it did come up liberal. But there was always the chance that you drew two liberals and one fascist yes. and passed one liberal yeah. and one fascist yeah. over. Well, what I was going to say is we have now seen a lot. If, if we believe literally everything everybody has said, we have now seen Which a lot of fascist cards. Yeah, and I will also say that you can never assume that just because a liberal agenda thing passed that one of the people involved is a liberal. Right. Does this ver very early in the game, when it costs almost nothing for a liberal card to get passed, if you were a fascist, a good way to like get yourself in good with everybody is like, I was one of the administrations that passed a uh, liberal one. That's right. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, there's some like heat on her, so potentially. I haven't played yet this game. In the last game. Rude. <laughs> New Stu Rude. Okay, so Arnie. Uh, <laughs> New Stu Rude, dude. <laughs> uh, I'm excited after a lot of time to finally hold some kind of office. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do, and you know what? Do we reset the, uh, the failure? Yes, okay. Oh, is that how that works? Okay, I guess I didn't know that. Uh, I'm going to follow my philosophy on this. I, I, you know, I don't really need any more information right now from the side of the table, so I'm going to okay. sort of pass it as far along yeah. as I can. I get to be me. While still getting new information. While still getting new information. I'm into it. Okay. While Tommy sizes me Just up. Huh. used the no card yet. Yeah, I'm not I haven't used the no either, card like, yet either because I haven't felt like I had any data that told oh, me. Oh, no, that's not true. I voted against Trin and Anita last time when she was Hitler. <laughs> and I was a fascist. I know Trent. <laughs> I remember. Flashback. <laughs> Are we ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Okay. What? So we got Did you vote? three, no. three no. nines. Who's the third? Stu. Who's the third nine? Oh, of course it's that. Yep. Okay. Uh, Stu, why did you go with no on this one? Because Arnie voted no a while ago, and I think he might be a fascist. What? <laughs> Just based on him so saying you no? Most voted on what yeah. you thought. I will say, he's going with information that he has. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One yeah. piece of it. He's got a reason. This one wasn't random. Adult votes no every time, and yeah. no one yells no one it. That's very true. Uh, it's a lovely strategy. Tommy, why did you go with no? I thought the, like, the rule he used to pick Mike was so weirdly specific. He was like, <laughs> I'm gonna go, so I know good, so I'm gonna go as far back as I can while still getting a new player and it being one more person than the distance that I, I voted no on, on Anita. And then Trin was like, yup. I'm like, there's no way that, I don't know, that just felt like a weirdly talking? specific okay, no, reason. No, 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 okay, we have information about this entire side of the table. If he were to pick somebody on this side of the table who already played a fascist policy, like, everybody's kind of had so, their hands in the pickle jar. I'm not I, suggesting. So I, Tommy, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, I had the exact and same we're impulse. also ahead. I had the same impulse. It just felt something. It, felt it just something, felt but, something. That's but the reason. But with his logic, 
it's literally the only person he could pick. 100%. Like, there's no, and if he didn't pick him, then that would be super shady. I agree. So, so I, that's why I voted yes, even though I was kind of like, oh, I don't know about that. And I might be wrong here. I'm just saying, right, like, it is true what you said. Trin, you are correct. We know everyone here. We don't know anything about Mike. Like, that's a perfectly good reason. It was just like, just such a, such a really specific nitpicky reason that it felt like. Well, let's a see reason what covering another one. Yeah, I yeah. like. I understand feeling that way, but I wholeheartedly disagree with you. But I do acknowledge that your feelings are valid. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, would you have felt better about it if I had just established it with some kind of pun? <laughs> I, I would have. Not like better in the sense that I wouldn't have liked you more, but like I, yeah, I would have maybe voted for it. Um, <laughs> so I'll, you're I'll, saying your like of Arnie has hit a ceiling? No. No, just puns are not going to be the thing that. Win me over. All right. I hate puns. Look, it's, it's, yeah. I, I hate love them. them. That's a <laughs> I didn't realize how punny everything is. Munchkin is. Yes. Oh, that it was It should have been called Punchkin. It should have. And then it would have not played it. I'm into it still. Who's trying up here? <laughs> Dick, put his discard in there. Oh, just thank you. What's happening? I'm deciding. I'm trying to find oh. a place for myself. Um, I'm not deciding. Uh, where that, do the discards go? Over here. Over there. You just slide it around. Wait, he's holding onto those cards. He's been holding onto the whole cards no. the whole time. No, no. Yeah. 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 And, and reveal. Got it. Okay. Now, what were you handed? What do you think I was handed? Two fascist cards. Okay. And Arnie, what did you draw? I'm very excited because I got uh, two liberals and a fascist, so I passed a liberal and a fascist did card. You know? So, did you now? We, I now know That's that you're great. a fascist. But even if people don't believe me, we now have two weird. You also, though, said, said, said you got two liberal and a fascist and you burned a liberal. Yeah, absolutely. Why, more did me, why did you give me no choice at all? Why did you give me no choice at all? I don't know. It's it seems like question. early enough in the game, it seems more valuable to get more information about uh, where people stand, especially since so much stuff is up in the air. As opposed to at this guaranteeing point, I do a not trust policy. Matt, Tommy, or Arnie. I think that they are. I three voted of the no four. for a. F That's look at great. that. I think <laughs> that you are three of the four. I don't oh, Travis, trust you're my heart. Matt anymore, and I'm iffy between Arnie and Mike. That would be such a. I mean, I don't know. That's Arnie a power play. Philosophically, how many people? So philosophically, people here, if you're a liberal and it's early in the game, Is this you. Early? I would never do what you did. You would never do what I did. I would no. a thousand percent. I would also yeah. never do what like you did. That seems like how you lose a game. No, I, it's not, because now we know more. About, well, I mean, I, I like Matt. <laughs> <laughs> I, I understand why you're saying you did it. I also would not have done it. I would definitely have done it. I that. would do that, too. I, I think it's, like, it's an open question. Like There are valid ways to play that. I'm concerned about like what a specific lie that would be from Arnie. Right, because Arnie, like, if Arnie's lying, he is inventing two liberal policies where he only needs to have invented one. Right. I mean, one of those liberal policies is going in the discard pile anyway. Correct. Yeah, it sounds like a couple of fascists here are defending another fascist. <laughs> what? <laughs> Which two? These oh, two guys are defending Arnie. So, what is this? It's this simple math. Oh, okay. I think Arnie um, did the right thing. Yeah, I, I, agree. I know why you think that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, but I'm also thrown off right now, and maybe this is too many layers deep. But Matt has no, been man, accused of being a fascist a couple times, and he's still continuing to act the exact same way that he is. So is he a fascist who's trying to make us question the fact that he's a fascist? Oh, God, he's Travis. Acting so, I know. <laughs> he's playing, like, you did mention your logic chess right now. Skill. I know. But at this point, he has not altered his behavior at all, even though we keep, and he's not making a case for himself. So it makes me think like he is a fascist who's trying to draw attention away from Hitler. No, I, I got a fascist card early on, so I'm gonna take heat throughout this game and that's fine. All I can do is try to like logic out of it and, and let it go. Cause like, if people don't trust me, I'm not gonna win you guys back over. But I know what Stu did, and I just have to live. <laughs> I know what Stu did. I know, I know what, what, what Stu did last summer, summer yeah. is the shirt I want. Okay. <laughs> like I, I know, I know not to trust Stu. Other, other than that, I'm just trying to suss it all out. I don't know about Arnie. I'm not sure about Tommy. I, I it's you know, who knows? I feel like. All I can do is uh, logic it out. Is what you say when you know you did a bad thing? Because usually when you're accused of being a fascist and you're not, you're not like, well, I hope to through my actions. You're like, please believe me, please. I, I got, I got 
Wow. I got screwed you, right at the beginning of the game. You've rehearsed yeah. that so well. <laughs> yeah. Did you I, do that in the mirror this morning? No, it's actually a, a stolen Dave Chappelle bit. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to nominate. Wait, wait, I got to do an investigation. Yeah. So uh, I am, uh, I, I kind of mostly think Matt is a fascist in this because he has sort of, right. sort of has been kind of turned off since, since that uh, interaction at the beginning, which, but uh, it is appealing to me to just know, so I am going to investigate Stu. Sure. Oh, that's a good move. Yeah. I was gonna say Adel, but that's also, that right. makes sense. Oh, but if a chain, this won't be too complicated. Oh. And I understand but if the that logic people of feel complicated thing. about me, which I get, but at least, I, at least it'll be helpful for myself to know. So what is Stuart? Stu is a liberal, which leads me to believe that Matt is a fascist. So Matt. Okay. Is, so, so if you I believe kinda, my version of the game, Matt the and Mike are pretty definitively <laughs> fascist. Just saying. No. Okay. So Stuart has said that he looked at Anita's card, and so, Anita's card is a liberal. Arnie has said that he looked at Stuart's card, and Stuart's card is a liberal. Yes. So either Stuart and Arnie are fascists, or Anita and Stuart are both liberals. Right. So the the way to think about this is when you have a bunch of liberal claims is fascism goes like upstream. So if Anita is a fascist, these two also have to be fascist. Yeah. But Anita could be a liberal, and it could be just Correct. these two, or it could be just Arnie, who's the fascist. Right. Right. I but, almost followed that. Thank you. <laughs> you can't have fascists downstream of. Liberals. No. Yeah, those because are a liberal salmon. wouldn't lie about someone being right. fascist and say they're liberal. Quick question for Adel, because you're the next president. So if you are forced to, or you want to, pass a fascist policy, you will unlock the moving the president to whoever you want. Gotcha. Who do you trust enough to do that with? What is that rule? So the rule is if a fascist policy is, is uh, unlocked on this uh, term, then he gets to give this president card to whoever he wants, like term, oh. term limits be damned. Um, we still get to vote on the pairing, mm -hmm. but it's important to know who he would pick. And then the president who he gives it to gets to pick their chancellor exactly. without having given that information away. Uh, here's, my, okay. uh, here's my play, just to kind of um, let you know, be transparent. I'm gonna give, uh, I'm gonna try and vote in Anita as chancellor. I'm still gonna vote no, but uh, <laughs> because she's towards the tail end and I uh, feel bad that she put her trust in me and I uh, uh, didn't deliver. Um, and then if I, if that passes and I get that power, I'll probably make Travis president. I like it. Because that's pretty far away from me. And also, I feel like Travis is... I is, think Travis is the only one we can really totally It's the trust. only one right now that I think... Hey, well, thanks. I think Sorry. I trust because I don't he's in the middle of this. Love that Sorry. Matt Why do we totally trust Travis? Trust? Yeah, I, do, I, do. no, I wasn't because, clear on that one either. I don't have any proof of that. No, I don't You trust make a good argument. Oh. Oh. Wait, why? Because I'd here's like to why he said that, is because I just said that he was not changing the way that he was playing at all, and I was making a strong case against him as a fascist. So throwing his hat into my ring makes me question. There's this only, is why I haven't said anything I, since the beginning of the I, game, because everything I say is tainted. Oh, now he's poisoning the world. Well. <laughs> there's way. only one person we can trust. That's Trin. She hasn't done anything. I haven't done anything yet. But uh, to be fair, I, I don't want to be president twice. I don't think that makes any sense. And I am cool with the presidency going to Travis. That, I, and I, because I don't want it over here, you yeah. know? Yeah. Yeah. Why? Oh, because then, because we'll be president like right away. Yeah. No, she, she's talking about putting the order, she, the order double, thing. Double yes. too much yeah. 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 Oh, I lost my first I, I may be going too far down the rabbit hole, but since I don't trust Mike, Mike uh, is suggesting Trin, and then Trin is suggesting Travis. That that's a long path, but it's so that's a very long like, path. That, you you <laughs> counted six other fascists. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> that's uh, that much. Oh my God, guys, we have too many fascists. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like, last time everybody vibed me a little bit, I actually forgot who the last fascist was in the last game, I'll be honest. Uh, everyone's vibing me fascist this time. <laughs> okay, what are we doing? Right. Sorry. Who's our voting on uh, Anita, Anita as Chancellor? Anita as Chancellor guy. Okay, um, sure, well, that seems obvious. Uh, three, two, one. Two oh. no's. Who was the second no? Mike. Mike. I mean. I mean, you weren't going to say no. I wasn't going to say yes to that. Why not? Because he gave me no choice when I placed that card. Oh, right. Who's oh, yeah. Arnie? Or who's, who's he? Because uh, if know, you I assume I, I oh, endorse I Stewart as a liberal. I'm like not yeah. following yeah. 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 Gotcha. Give you these three. Okay. We're like way too many levels. We're all yeah. thinking. Yeah. We're doing yeah, this yeah, thing yeah. where it's like right. loving it. <laughs> so we're going to know if Adel's a fascist. Oh, sure. Yep. This is 
just a train wreck. We're gonna pass so it back. Or, no, okay. wait, where so, is coming to be? What do we got? What do we got? There, yeah. you picked one or two. Motherfucker. I got two fashion Did it do? Fantastic. Did I okay. three fashions? Okay. Uh, Not statistically okay. very likely. No. So, I think oh, wait, well, so Arnie it's said, we'll go through the same thing we did last time, right? Arnie said that he got two and threw one away. Yep. yep. We have two on the board. So yeah. that's four. Yes. And then there's, so are we assuming that those last two there are the other two, like, uh, are the other two uh, liberal wait, cards? There's about a 17% well, chance of that? Yeah. Wait, we, but also Stuart at the beginning said that he passed over a liberal and, uh, <laughs> well, can't, this isn't black There are pretty. still two cards in the deck. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. We don't, those two cards could be the opposite of what we, what you think. And I said there's about a 17% uh, yeah. chance that those I, I are think both. It's three of these. That those are both my, liberal. I, I don't know. No. no. Well, you can't brain man a deck of lies. Okay, okay so. so. <laughs> you can't brain man a deck of lies. That's pretty good. That, uh, that's fantastic. That, that's that needs to be on the box yeah, in the next, next version. Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. So if I understand this Game correctly, idea. if you believe me that I got two fascist cards and I had, didn't have a choice, and you're claiming that you had three fascist cards, but nah, I don't know about that. Um, many, the, but, you get, but you get to pick the next deck? president. So six. whoever the next president, he... No, fascist cards. There's, there's only six oh, fascist cards. Six, six fascist, uh, fascist cards, 11. There are 11, 11 fascist, sure. six liberal? Yeah. So, so it's mathematically yeah. probable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's still yeah. possible. It just seemed like a lot of fascist well, cards. Well, like the last game, we knew someone was lying about burning them because like right. it didn't, the math didn't work out. But at this point, there's no way to prove that either Arnie or Stewart are lying about them getting burned. Not from the cards. Not from the cards. I trust that somebody lied about it, but it just sucks for me that this is, I'm the most recent one and it's that position. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Well, you I, know, I feel I like understand the doubt, but you it's have also some control. Just, I was in the exact same position last game. I yeah. had to play the third one and yeah. I, was, yeah. I, I was a total liberal. Thank so you for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I you will say bring that. bring the last game okay. in. So, um, are you still going with Travis for president? Yeah, so I'm going to fulfill know. my, my uh, the rules. promise. That makes sense to me. So here's the I problem. Oh, at this point, I'm not confident. Don't you, you, you also anyone. Ad also gets to look at a thing, right? No, but he no, chose no, Travis. Okay. No, this is just the president. Because at this point, like, I know that I passed uh, Matt a liberal and a fascist, and he picked the liberal, but that doesn't prove to me that he's liberal. And so Stewart you, looked at it. You passed a liberal and a fascist. What was the one that you discarded? I discarded a fascist. Yeah. Well, never mind. <laughs> Because I wouldn't do that. Because you wouldn't do that. You've already, um, you've already made that clear. And Stuart looked at Anita's card and said liberal. And Arnie looked at Stuart's card and said liberal. So it's very likely to me that Anita is a liberal unless she just passed a all ball. three of them are fascists and they're really just trying to shore each other up by doing the investigation. It's possible that only two of them are. In that, but that's in that it wouldn't be Anita. But, in that but if it Anita goes, would be the one who got screwed. Then Anita in the last would be right. the most trustworthy one. You know, that's how three. I've always felt. It feels <laughs> like to me, though, it's a better strategy if people. It, it feels like to me if there's like fat, like potential fascists or people that are kind of tainted in the game, and you are also a fascist. It kind of seems better to just kind of cut bait. <laughs> well, at this right? point, instead of, of being, instead of, so so like if I were fascist. And there was some s suspicion about Stu. I wouldn't necessarily be chance, like, man. I'm going to put a lot of my oh, capital you're the, into. You're you're but Anita was. Too. Okay, so at this point, it's really oh, yeah, easy to I'm figure sorry. out because the two of you conflicted. The two of you conflicted. Uh -huh. The two of you were just in the previous government, so I can't pick either one of you. Yeah. So at this point, I'm looking at these three. Okay. If you're and only looking for non conflict I said very early on that I didn't trust you, and She'll you'll be the president next. So I have to go with the guy that I passed. I think I, the I, liberal that makes sense. and I the fascist do, and he picked the liberal. That's the only piece of information Pre I have. Presuming, track, yeah. presuming you don't want to pass it. And I will say, if at this point you don't trust him, you should vote no. And we're because not, I do not know for sure that he is yeah, not. This is vote. your mistake. It's not a glowing endorsement. Yeah. 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 I, would like to, I would like to nominate <laughs> as not, my chancellor someone I don't trust. We're not if you say no, that's <laughs> fine. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Totally. Oh, we're in the Hitler zone. We are in the Hitler zone. We are in the Hitler zone. I'm sorry. I apologize. I do this every game. Can I from this vote? No. I, I do this every game. What is the consequence of us Travis, getting elected? Get if he is someone. Hitler, then no, no, the I know that. Way. If we pass a fascist law, what is the consequence? Who will you kill? Fascist what? gets to kill someone. Travis has to kill someone. And, and if you're if he's it's Hitler, it's about it. fascism. <laughs> I would probably kill. Fascism is bad. It is. 
Yeah. 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 And you made a game of that. Once Thank again, you. I, I, I don't know anything. No, I, yeah. I, I felt, I I felt so, the, the tremor in the voice. It's got to be me or Stu. Yeah. So I, yeah, yeah, like that's the thing. is It's one of these two pairs of that, you know what I mean? And like, because I've been living with this one since the second move of the game. Right. It, Honestly, it if you mad. didn't pick Matt, I would find that suspicious. Yes. So, so uh, this is. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna vote. If you elect me chancellor, I promise Coke in the water fountains, uh, and we'll get like Coca Cola. More. Yeah, I want, to be very, uh, I want to be very clear about what this means. All these students have nosebleeds. Whoa! I'm ready for my bike ride. <laughs> Reset. <laughs> Then vote no. I'm gonna. Three, Thank you. Do you vote no if you don't know? In the Hitler zone, you do. Don't vote no. No, I voted. Vote I voted no. yes when I didn't know the rest this of the game. But this one, I just have no right. idea what's gonna we happen. We need to even the score over here. I get. I get it. I do. All right. Okay. But Shall we? Three, two, yeah. one. Uh, so four, three, four five, notes. four Six. notes. Passes. Okay. Pass. So it does pass. Excellent. Uh, are you Hitler? I am not Hitler. Okay. <laughs> so now we have a piece of information for sure. I'm gonna go throw up. Okay. Oh boy. Yeah. Please make Travis kill someone because I don't want to. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So that, was, that was the decision I had because I had two I had two fascists and a liberal. Yeah. And I thought, I know I'm liberal, so if I hit hand him two fascists, I get to decide who to kill. Yeah. yeah. But then I also thought you might also I hand him two fascists. We pass another fascist law and get closer yeah. to losing. I don't, so, I don't think you can ever make that. Yeah. Decision. So, yeah. Oh, I so had also knowing that you're not Hitler, and the fact that if you were a fascist, you could have like won the game in that moment. Yeah. So right. that leads me to be pretty confident that you're a liberal. Yes, I am a liberal. Right. Okay. It's weird. That if moment we is... believe that he's a liberal, then yeah, you the picked him as an ex-president. Oh, yes, the only thing, the only thing we know for sure now is that if he hasn't been in the previous administration, you can safely pick Matt as chancellor if you are liberal. And I can't take advantage of this at all, and I might lose the game for my team right now. So <laughs> I, you'd still be one and one today. If if I could have picked, if I could have picked Anita as chancellor, I would have picked her as chancellor over Matt. Because why couldn't you pick me? Oh, because I was because you're in the previous. Generally. Because so at this point, oh that rule didn't Stu apply said to she the was chancellor liberal. position. And Arnie said she was liberal. I mean, Arnie said Stu was liberal. So the only way that Anita is fascist is if all three of them are fascist here in this corner. Okay. And like, if I have to pick between which two of them are lying, I feel like he's lying and he would be liberal. So like, I'm. Th this is where I. I just before we knew for sure he wasn't Hitler. Yeah. There was more evidence that I could come up with that would support me trusting her, other than he passed the liberal. But I voted item. in that. I voted in the last. Liberal policy. Well, I voted yeah. in the last administration, and Stu voted no to it. Which okay. I'm confused. You, you're the one of the only How ones. How stressful is this to watch yeah. knowing you everything? Said, yeah. <laughs> like, you're just like, come on already. You, you said you had uh, only a couple of choices over here. I did. Why isn't Tommy a choice? Because, well, they were the three choices. Oh, sorry, he was one of them. Yes, okay. and I didn't, I just said from the beginning that I thought he was a I'm sorry. I just, I, <laughs> I've only passed one policy, and it was a liberal policy, yeah, and I, I I was the one who got Anita back in the game. Yes. Right. Yeah. I just... Tommy seems... So, Tommy, I'm sorry. Job. It's okay. I think you should make Anita. It's change. fine? I mean, okay. It's good idea. So I'm trusting you two quite I come a bit. off weird. I am between these three people, essentially. So like, Which three? Uh, Anita, Tommy, and Arnie. Uh, because Tommy and Anita yeah. are both part of a liberal policy. Can you refresh me on your voting record real quick? I, uh, I gave uh, a fascist and a liberal to Mike as a way of testing him. Uh -huh. uh, I banked way too hard on my own likability to think that people were going to believe me. <laughs> <laughs> and I was just well, sort of like, I, I just sort of like, great, I'll have information. People will, uh, people will believe me. So this and that was, be so that was the answer you said I had two. Liberal and yeah, one. It, it is. It definitely had two liberal had and that. one. And yep. I honestly, like, if I were in his position, I would have made the same choice, which is why I'm not ruling him out. Yeah. It was early on, and it felt like information is most valuable. Not so early let me explain early. why I am now between Arnie and Tommy. I am a little bit afraid that Tommy is trying to go very hard. She's like, I put Anita back in the game, which makes me feel like sure. Anita might be Hitler. And I feel like at this point, I would really rather not take that, that gamble. No. And I feel like it's less of a gamble to do Tommy or Arnie. 
What do you think? Well, I agree so with, I think, I agree hold with on, the logic hold on. I think it is insane to think I'm a fascist trying to put Anita back in the game, but that I'm safe. Sure, but... That is fair. But, Here's so the thing, is at this fair. point, like, so the two of them, we don't trust one of them, right? So between the two of them, one of them's fascist. Yes. And between the two of them, one of them's fascist. Right. And right now, we also have a chain of Arnie saying that Stewart is liberal. And so if one of them's fascist, and we say, okay, well, maybe it's Stewart, then Arnie is also a fascist, right. and he's also in this parent. The, so the four of them, I don't think you can pick any one of them. I so feel Arnie like I'm screwed no matter what I do. I, do. I, I swear, Tommy's so the only person we don't have any clue about. Tommy? I, I will say, I also don't want to say that my, That's true my too. one thought of him was like from the beginning is, he was one of the like first four people that voted no okay. against the thing, and so, so I'm a little I bit would phrase it sure. As, but it would be really like no. What I'm saying is I've been carrying that the whole time. I have no other reason other than my right. gut. Out of those three, he wasn't the one that I would have picked. So here's what's going on in my head right now. Okay. Obviously, I trust myself with the bullet as a president because I'm liberal and I will shoot Matt, who has been very clearly a fascist. Sorry, Matt. That's okay. Um, <laughs> and we just reshuffled. Your campaign is always shooting somebody in the face. I love yeah. doing it. So, uh, and the deck just got reshuffled, which means right. how many liberals are in the deck? Uh, we've actually had one uh, yeah. since then, but yeah. there should be three. There should be three more liberals in the deck. Okay. So does that make it very? It's, it's, it's very likely like, you're going to get fascists. Three okay. liberals, six fascists. Okay. Ooh. But that's a that's just <sighs> supposing, right? Because we have two cards discarded. Well. If we are to believe what's been said, yeah. then it's three. God, I really don't know. I think you okay. can pick I know Anita's I don't want you to pick her. Who, who, do, who would the two of you vote for? Would you vote for Arnie, or would you vote for Anita? I would vote for Anita, yeah, I just said that. Okay. I would vote for I think Anita. I'm, an, okay. I'm a no here no matter what, because this level of consensus building makes me feel like. <laughs> yeah, that's not, yeah, that's not something. I'm, 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 I'm in the Hitler yeah. condition. I have a I, bullet. I, are you I kidding look, me? Again, like, this is Trin, a really tense moment. I, I get it. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong. I just am just this okay, much. Okay, you're wrong. Anita, by... here you go. <laughs> okay. I want to. I just want to rehearse the three arguments we've heard from Trin in the last five minutes. I don't trust Anita because Tommy's trying to get her back in the game, so maybe she's Hitler. I'm... So I trust Tommy. But she's already. Tommy's shit, being so weird. Be Fine, she's I'm already, going with wait, Anita. Not, wow, that's not. Really they don't matter that. <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm the good honest. news is it's almost two fifty. So yeah. Yeah. here we go. <laughs> All right, let's vote. I'm confused enough that I like to lean on my fellow liberals. The end. Okay, let's vote. Three, two, one. I'm still Is it up or down? Up. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Yeah, so it's. Who are the no's? Uh, I need a no from Hitler? Tommy. No. Yeah. Okay. So raise your card. Who oh. are the no's again? I'm sorry. I'm no, yes. Okay. Uh, so yeah. it's just Tommy and so Mike. So Tommy and Mike. We know for sure. We got two Don't. safe chancellors on the table. Bad news, we're going to have to find one more because Matt. Here's my discard. Oh. That's oh, right. I that's the discard. Oh, so there's a high likelihood Wait, this is going to be a fact. Who are the two safe chancellors? The two safe chancellors are uh, Matt and Tanita. Because they have both just said they are not yet there. Oh, okay. so you have to murder someone? Oh, gotcha. Well, it's Got Matt. It. I mean... Matt, I'm so sorry. And the house rules are you're allowed to talk, but only in ghost noises now. But you have to say... Oh, he actually prefers those. Can you straighten them? Uh, so it is for sorry. sure <laughs> Matt. Yeah, it's so Matt. you're kidding. Matt. Are you Hitler? Are you Hitler? I am not Hitler. Oh, I'm well, not Hitler. The win condition is. <laughs> I'm not Hitler. Sorry, win condition is we have to we have to pass two more liberal policies. Two more yes. of either. Or shoot. Hitler. Yeah, or in game. Shoot Hitler. In game is. Or elect two more Hitler. Of either Chancellor. Elect Hitler or kill Hitler. Okay. Elect Hitler, Chancellor. Right. Wait, whether or not you trust me. <laughs> we are doing best. Yeah. Be very sure. I wouldn't go for like a this guy might be Hitler shoot vote because I just feel like we don't have any enough information to say this is a Hitler. Wait, I don't, I would, that wouldn't happen unless, I don't, I don't have a bullet to use right now. You'll so have a bullet if you pass, if you pass a fashion. You can trust me right. as chancellor. That's a, that, I, I feel like you would be playing a really long game, and I would feel okay with being duped by it if you <laughs> <laughs> and, yeah, you're, you're willing uh, to And I would actually be honored to have been if so. If, <laughs> no if you are, uh, no yeah. reason to think that sacrificing the Republic would trump your own personal feelings of satisfaction. Yeah, that's all I care about right now. <laughs> That's why it's at a table. Sure. Uh, so I'm gonna do it, and if you're Hitler, then uh, and we elect you, then I'm gonna. Uh, it'll be great. I'll feel. I'll feel <laughs> what? I'll feel wonderfully. It'll be great. No, my point is that I will. It'll be great. I will. That's a suspicious. Your thing argument to is say. that he would have been playing such a long game that he'll be able to dab for the rest of the time. <laughs> exactly. Until my hand yeah. falls off. Okay. Wait. So uh, you? Yeah. I would be chancellor. 
We can also vote this down and go, Mike what? picks Matt. Why, I mean, why Travis is, trust Travis is responsible why for, like, can pick almost for at least two of these. Yeah. I can pick I him if he's not and a I'm picking someone that I that wasn't Hitler. Yeah, if well, I was a fascist, I, I would trust, know he was Hitler. I, feel like or you, I, would, have, I, would, I would obviously I rather you pick me because I know. <laughs> No, I'm a liberal. But, I know, but you. Yeah. you, yeah, you what I'm saying like, is well, he's dead. We were, in, guys were in, we were in the Hitler zone, right? If I and when oh, I was president, I got to zone? pick. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I was a it's fascist. Like I got to pick. Yeah. So I feel good about it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Unless I was a deep cover fascist trying to get okay. my other fascist. Let's reveal. Suppose it was a. It was. I suppose it was like a resume builder for Hitler, right. but I. Okay. Reveal. Yes. Are you Hitler? I am not Hitler. Oh, yay! That was close. That always feels bad. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. oh, right. So wait. No, you oh, still no, have. Oh, it's me. Oh, we're doing you this. You still yeah, have work right. to do. Yeah, we right. don't. Oh yeah, my God, that's just... down to three cards, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, holy yeah. God. Okay. Yeah, right. And there should be uh, three liberals spread out among. So that's discovered. Uh -huh. Six cards. All right. Big don't, money, don't no get me wrong. Big T. This is this card. Yeah. 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 Government works. Wow, I don't know what to do at all. Uh, all right, I open the table to what? bids Wait, for the what? chancellorship. Uh, uh, I have a suggestion. <laughs> no matter no who he picks, we're going to vote no. Conf yeah. Oh, OK. Really? Because Why? at this point, one of those two is lying, right? Oh, right. Which means one of those two is fascist, because okay. they're conflicted. So no matter who he picks at this point, oh. we're one liberal vote away. Yeah, we vote this down to Travis and Anita. Yeah, like, we, he, we can't yeah. trust him. Wow. So I can like, and we, but to be fair, we also oh. couldn't trust Arnie or Stewart at this point. So, <laughs> so like, no but, matter what they say, even if you're completely even trustworthy, if, even if I can pass no. the last liberal policy, you don't. We have to vote no. You, I'll take Chancellor if you want. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, so Boom. the only people I feel relatively good about are Tommy, Adeline, and Trin. I'm honestly. I feel like I'm being cracking here. Like I feel like I you're going down. You're like, oh, I'm gonna like bring just, this. I shit haven't down seen with anything it. from you that tells me what you're doing. So and maybe I'm missing it. Maybe it's just Gen uh, Con fugue. Anita's eligible again. Confirmed. And yeah. to confirm non Hitler. Why would I? Pick a confirmed non Hitler. No, I know. I don't know. Like, <laughs> I got that part. Good I question. I got that part. <laughs> There's a long game being played here. I will say, at this point, if you're going to vote no matter what, like, should, should we I could pick, really shorten this whole should I pick, so yeah. Should, yeah, yeah. Oh, so should I should pick Anita, right? Yeah. Because that'll test, Hitler. that'll test whether or not you will vote I'm no the only yes. person at this table that you know is not Hitler other than me and Travis, we'll and you can't choose Travis. Travis. Yeah. We'll just fail so it, Travis and Anita. If you're a fascist, you should pick someone else. Well, I also, to be fair, no. Not just because oh, Anita, yeah. uh, just because he picks Anita, we shouldn't still vote yes. Of course, because right, he will also right. still be the first person to sort through tiles, and then I'll get a bullet. Yeah, right. I'll get a bullet. Okay. Oh yeah. yeah. Yes. 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 Uh, yes. So we still said even with a confirmed Hitler. Yeah. Yes. Right. Yes. Great. 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 And we're Oops. voting no on this because no. this is shady. Yes. Because okay. at this point, this when I shady. become president, I will pick either her or Matt to be my chancellor. And we know neither one of them are Hitler. Oh, okay. Three, two, one. How do we know Matt's not Hitler? Adol. Good work. <laughs> 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 Did he vote yes? Did he vote yes? I picked my moment. <laughs> How do we know Matt's not Hitler? Right. He, he was the first chancellor I picked. And so then give me some time. Oh. I have a perfect track record. Very bad. Oh, I don't have yeah. I failed all the way. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So that goes to me. Yep. So Travis. Goes. Yeah, and I'm going to say Anita is my chancellor. Great. Cool. I am voting for this, positively. Okay. Three, <laughs> two, one. Did you become Hitler? <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's he's the last he was confirmed not Hitler. Yeah. Okay. Uh, oh, he's next. Oh, right. Did you vote no? Yeah, I thought she was not. I didn't. I forgot that she was confirmed not Hitler. Okay. There you go. Boom. Yes. Uh, oh, we Raise your hand. Yeah. Who was the other fascist? Right. Like, oh, if you're Hitler, raise your hand. Uh, <laughs> I was trying so hard not to think of you as a fascist, and I was like, I but thought, she totally is. I thought yeah, about it. I was like, the, oh, it's like bias. So it's the two of you and you, right? Yeah. 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 I thought about handing out all the, the. And you shot him to say I had to, to because it might, Matt just rolled right under the bus in the beginning, yeah. and I was just like. I, I will can't. say, though. 
whether you meant to or not. What it also did is basically make me question everything. Yeah, I know. I feel bad. Yeah, I yeah, was yeah. always... But I, so early on. I, I very intentionally did that because I figured everyone was going to think Trin was a fascist again. <laughs> yes. And I was like, I'm just going to take all the heat Smart and like, let the heat come my way. Yeah. Fine. And I was like, once you said you were going to kill me, I was like, yes, exactly. That's right, the right. Right because thing I will to do. say... I didn't suspect you at all that game. Good. You didn't suspect Trin at all? No. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I, know. I, I definitely, I, I, but the, I also didn't thing that, trust the, her. Yeah, yeah that's didn't true. I, I definitely, hard, this game. I that's hardcore I suspected actually, Trin actually, when you I was were suggesting her as <laughs> early on. Well, you had to. You actually just Yeah, yeah, you had to. What did you all think knowing, because you won? Yeah, what was the difference? Yeah. Were there any points where you were like, come on? Yay! Yay! I don't take credit for that. I still feel good right, about how have, close it We have just a few more uh, oh, no. minutes to so close ways, out the stream. So I just want to quickly go around and plug everyone's uh, stuff one more time. Uh, Soldier Girl on the table. Uh, Mike Salinger, your new game is Thornwatch, available here at Gen Con and on the internet. Brothers Chap, you can back the Trogdor Kickstarter project. I am personally a backer. I endorse this project. It looks really cool. I'm very excited about it. Trin Garitano, creator of the Friendshipping podcast. Anything else you want to plug? Yeah, um, I'm writing a, a, on a team with a new game from Asmati. Um, you can see us in 142. It's a cute game about little turnip people. Aww. Uh, Thank you. Adel, Arnie, and Matt are the co-creators of the very, very funny and good podcast, uh, Hello from the Magic Tavern. I highly recommend it. Start from the beginning. It's There's probably a, it's probably my favorite comedy podcast, other than all oh. of the other people, oh. people oh. Yeah. 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 which are which are, which are co-equal. It's, it's co-equal. Are there any tickets still available? We should say the that there night? are a few, a few tickets left for our show tonight at the Schrott Center with uh, Travis as our guest. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. And uh, I will I will be there. I'm looking forward to that. Uh, and uh, Arnie, as well, is uh, uh, one of the uh, designers of the Jackbox Party Pack games, the new Jackbox Party Pack coming out uh, later this year. Uh, Tommy, do you want to plug your new game? Or yeah, I'm, I, after Secret Hitler, I'm trying to get out of the games that become real business. Uh, so my... <laughs> yeah, good job, you. <laughs> good Sorry job, about the you. Jumanji situation, everyone. Good news. <laughs> My next game is just about uh, robots that you can't tell aren't people. Uh, it's called Inhuman Conditions. We're also in Room 142, and you can learn more at uh, robots.management. That's going to become real now. Oh, no! <laughs> Skynet, no! Uh, Anise Sarkeesian, founder of Feminist Frequency, host of the Feminist Frequency radio podcast, also excellent. And a book coming out. And a book coming out. October 2nd, History versus Women, The Defiant Lives That They Don't Want You to Know. Hell Free order yeah. now. You're wonderful. Yeah. Stuart Wellington, uh, co-host of the Flophouse podcast, also one of my favorite comedy podcasts. <laughs> <laughs> it's up there. And I own a bar in Brooklyn called Hinterlands. There you go. Uh, Travis McElroy, uh, you may not have heard of him, but he's an upri He's a rising star in the, <laughs> Man, in the I podcast hope that's true. world. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, anything you want to plug? You want to plug the new book? Uh, yeah, so our graphic novel is the first arc of the balance. It's the first chapter of the balance arc uh, called Here There Be Gerblins. It just came out about two weeks ago. I'm very, very proud of it. Uh, you can get it at theadventurezonecomic.com or in like most bookstores. Um, also, uh, Sunday, tomorrow morning, I'm doing a panel all about like DMing and GMing with some really great guests called Open DMs. And we're gonna like give advice and talk about our process and talk about like how to go about creating a fully fleshed out world that is also as inclusive as possible and represents actual people in real life and not just old tropes. Uh, so if you want to join us for that, it's 10 a.m. Uh, you can just search Open DMs Gen Con and find it. Cool, Yay. sweet. Uh, let's have one more huge round for all of our panelists. Thank you guys so much. For coming. Uh, if you're if you are if you are here at Gen Con, come to the Cards Against Humanity booth. It is number three thousand. We will register to you to, to vote in all fifty states. No, Wait, we don't care about party states? ID or anything like that. What's that? I can vote in all fifty states. I want that. Come talk to me. Yeah, talk to me after the panel. Um, and uh, what else? Oh, I also got a ban from the Twitch chat for this stream for arguing with people in the Twitch chat. So shout out to me. <laughs> for that incredible, incredible achievement of getting banned what? within minutes of going into the Twitch chat. Uh, I guess good job, moderators. <laughs> found me. Uh, yeah, yeah, fair enough. Uh, and uh, uh, final round of applause for uh, Maya for running the board. Woo! And for our uh, 
Chicago High School students who are running the Twitch stream. Thank you guys for doing this. And thank you guys all so much for coming. And Secret Hitler is for sale somewhere here. Breaking yeah, Games. At Gen Con. Breaking games. At Breaking Games. And don't forget, you can't rain man a deck of lies. No. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Thanks, everyone.